Unmute while we all make it. Hey. <laughs> hey, Dutch. Hey, How's the tummy, Dad? Uh, Wait, did we time that right? right? Tummy's all right. We did. We did. Damn. Pretty much. Tummy's all right. <laughs> you know, it is. It's one yeah, of those things. Tummy's all right, but how's everything else? Uh, my devil's doorbell hurts, but you know, it's. Uh, <laughs> Is Dude, I don't don't tell Rook and the Raven, but I bought some really really cheap disc binder refills off Amazon, and like they're perfect. So how could you? Do this? There goes that I sponsorship mean, out the fucking window. Yeah. Thanks, Duke. Why, don't tell him, guys. Did this to us. <laughs> Dude, the bespoke Rook and the Raven ones are so so, so fucking expensive. expensive. They're so no expensive idea. It's paper. like thirty sheets for like ten pounds. I just got like sixty sheets here or something for like a fiver or something. Like, come on, man. Just because it <laughs> says date, location, session number at the top. Look at this. These these have little little regions at the top as well that are separate. They're just not labeled fancy. So you know what? You know what? Really, if anything, the yours are more market. flexible. Yeah, they are exactly. Stop shooting us in the foot so we don't get sponsorship, yeah, what the guys. We, we might, Why get, my, we might get friends by like Eagle. If Rick and Raven sponsor us, I will only buy refills. I'm supposed to be the one that kills Same. our sponsorships. That's Same. my job. I mean, if Rook and the Raven sponsor us, we won't have to buy any of it. Here's That's the goal, true. okay? Here's true. the goal. This is where I'm at in my current. I've used this much of this notebook just for this campaign. So when I finish it, we need a Rook and the Raven sponsorship so I can Bet. get the second one from them. Done. Bet. Goals. Let's go. Because I, I was happen. running through the no pages in this game so fast. <laughs> hey, everybody. It is Sunday, which means uh, welcome Sunday back to Dungeon Select. Sunday. Session 10. <laughs> the Grave Digger <laughs> is at the, the, the Megadome or something. Session 10. Double digits. Yeah, Soko, okay? Soko's first character survived longer than his first character did in campaign one. What a good, uh, what a good lad. I mean, it actually. really happened last episode, but you know. yeah, well, but we, we made that realization uh, during uh, uh, discourse. So like, you know, I, I wanted to bring yeah. it up. Yeah. Um, All right, time to kill off Jack. I am coming off the back of a twelve-hour stream, and I'm a little hungover. So bear with me today, please. Thank you. Uh, appreciate it. No remorse. <laughs> Shut the fuck. Yo, everyone got their plans <laughs> out for the dumb the shit we want to do. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's do it. Um, Listen, the more dumb shit we do between yeah. ourselves, the less Dutch has to work. So that's true. That's true. That's true. That's, true. No, that's, that's, that's fair. In the we story, need boys. We need to focus on harassing and questioning, interrogating NPCs that's what we're doing. as much as possible. That's the goal. I'll turn this bus around. <laughs> Good thing it's not a bus; it's an airplane. Even worse. Yeah, what? <laughs> Maybe it's an Airbus. True. Uh, anyway, yeah, you think of that. Select, uh, we, uh, oh. Campaign 2, Session 10. Uh, before we get going today, uh, any announcements anyone wants to make? While I grab my dice? Oh, I have all the costume pieces from my Halloween costume nice. to be Maya from Blood Hunt. So I'm excited. Oh, yeah. Epic. I'm nice. gonna try and do like every stream in the final week of October in costume if possible. Jesus. It depends. It depends how easy it is to get the fangs in and out. Cause I got like the real legit kind that you actually like make a mold for your mouth and they like attach to your teeth and everything. Does that so it depends how the that goes. Halloween one shot? Yeah. Oh, I, that's the one that's a no, it's, it's guaranteed. I will, nice. no matter what, be wearing it for the Halloween one shot. But my streams before that, I'm gonna try and wear it a few times as well. Oh, yeah. Get used that's to awesome. them. So I can learn to talk with the fangs in by the time we get to D&D. &D. Yeah, because your character will actually speak in that, in that one shot. That's yeah! Crazy. That's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> uh, I had an announcement that I kind of forgot, but uh, I'll just go over the things oh. that I do remember to say. Uh, this Thursday on Dungeon Discourse, we'll have, we should have Laura and Ethan? Yep. Right? Uh, to, finish, to, to finish up the, the making NPCs and all that stuff. Uh, that yeah, would work pretty. pretty well. So, uh, can you guys both do that this Thursday? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Nice. Beautiful. Uh, tomorrow, me, Duke, and Ethan start a new uh, playthrough as a part of the, uh, you know, the Dungeon Select Plays series, I guess you could call it. Uh, we're going to get started with uh, Definitive Original Sin 2. We did all there is to do in the Baldur's Gate uh, patch 5 save file that we can do. They did announce new content and all that stuff for Baldur's Gate, but that would, would require us making a new save, and we just we just played, like, a bunch of Baldur's Gate, so 
We might, like, I think the next time we'll do Baldur's Gate on Dungeon Selects when the game is actually out, or, or when yeah. a lot of content updates have happened in the early access. By or the time we finish Divinity and the game's, like, mm -hmm. published. So I please like make that. sure it doesn't crash anymore by that point. Yeah, Divinity yeah. should be... <laughs> Divinity is a little least, better, but not much. Mm -hmm. I, I, I remember, had a pretty good experience with Divinity. Yeah. Oh, I, I remember my other yeah. announcement. Oh. Uh, this Wednesday, because uh, my other D and D offstream thing is over, I am my character finally joins the Dune campaign that I'm participating nice. in. Nice. So that's super dope. Um, oh, yeah. I will put the link in the chat for anyone interested in the Twitch channel if I'm permitted, because it's kind of hard to say. The name i stumble over it all the time and for anyone in the the eu it's it's really late for y'all so that's fair but they do go up on the channel's youtube as well so you can watch them later hell yeah hell yeah awesome uh no we haven't as much uh katie we're just doing the usual like announcements and all that stuff my twitch is still being <laughs> shit and i can't see chat and it's taking forever to connect i hate it Wait, it's not even my internet. It's literally just Twitch doing RAM. this. <laughs> no, that's you're not the only one. One of my normal viewers wrote my Discord like for some reason. He's like, I can only not watch your stream, uh, yeah. but I can watch others. And I was like, but other people were watching my stream fine. I was like, that's really weird. Like Twitch is just, it's Twitch. Katie, Twitch is what you do here is you the best of both worlds. You watch us with your flatmates. Yes. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Okay, what's, what's what's A T L A. All Avatar: The Last Airbender. Right, yeah, I knew that. All the Lola. <laughs> what? Uh, I hate this already. I want to go to bed. All, um, all the lol eyeing. You know, I gotta go to work. Um, um, oh no! I gotta, we want to go. Soko won't be here next week. <laughs> yeah. This is the last squeeze out as much as Jack's Soko back. Soko back, 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 back I actually have work today, though. So. Nice. I'm gonna Squeeze out we'll his be back for like a one shot, so you know it's only one week of, of not having Soko, guys. Halloween. We'll survive. We'll survive. We'll survive. You guys are just gonna upset here. Jax by the end of session, so he has an excuse to not talk it. to us next week. He's gonna be so mad at us for literally no reason. <laughs> yeah, I True. hate you guys. I'm not going to talk for about one to two days. I hate <laughs> you guys. Yeah. Um. So unless there's any more announcements, going once, going twice. It's old. Nice. Um, <laughs> we're on chat. one. I hate it. Y'all are, y'all are, y'all are, are some. Uh, this is last we left off, the party uh, retrieved the crown of corruption and turned it into jolly and all that good stuff. Got rewarded some money and a couple of potions. Um, just kind of hung out in uh, Southwold for the remainder of the time, and then went to bed. Before y'all wake up. I uh, have it. Uh, I have it on good authority that Bell immediately wants all of you to deafen real quick. <laughs> oh, oh my no! god! Bitch. Fuck you, Bell. Bell. Oh, Shatter! Or... Gifting ten subs to the community. Uh, hello. Right Hold on, I'm gonna started. undeafen right real quick. It started. Jesus. Okay. I, was, I guess this is the way Shatter's like. You all think you're flexing? This is the real flex, uh -oh. right here. Oh, we're flexing. Oh. Hot damn. Fucking hell. All right. Anyway, this D &D, so. episode of Dungeon Flex is sponsored by Old Shadow Geek. <laughs> <laughs> True. All right. Bell. Kess. That's me. You would like to speak to Blue. Yeah, so we're just hanging out in her vessel. She calls out for Blue. Mm -hmm. Um, it takes a little while. You kind of you kind of sit there in your in your what. Describe the vessel, like the inside. Oh yeah, yeah, I get what to is, describe the what vessel. Is, what is what is what what does it look like? How's what does the inside of the vessel look like? People okay. comfy. Yay! It's very comfy. Uh, mm -hmm. The vessel is kind of um, circular in shape. In the very center of the room is a bed that hangs from the ceiling. Nice. Um, the entire room is decorated in quite jewel tones. There are lots of like small chairs quite low to the ground lots of pillows literally everywhere there's a small desk at one corner which is now covered in gold that is just scattered about because okay. uh, she always puts her gold in the vessel so she doesn't get <laughs> robbed by tiny children um and and that's basically it it's always like kind of twilighty light as well it's very dusk light. 
All right, cool. So you call out for blue and uh, give it a few moments. And from this like cloud of blue smoke appears blue right in front of you. Going on. You told Dabby in my name. No, I didn't. All oh, right, then you told a crying fireman, and then he told Dabby in my name. Crying fireman? Yeah, he has tears. <clears throat> and I assume he's on fire all the time. Because the whole fire Run thing. that back for me real quick. What are you talking about? Davian says that, well, he knew my name, and the only way he could have known my name is if Kasuth told him, and the only way Kasuth could tell is if you told him. Right, see, now that's starting to make a little more sense. Um, I'm very upset. <laughs> first of all, Kosuth and I are friends, right? Yeah. We discuss things with each other, right? As I'm yeah. sure you do with your friends. Yeah, but not my name. What does it matter that much? Well, I'm very protective of my name. I know. If people know my name, they have a power over me that I don't like. And I grew up in the Feywild. It's like ingrained you don't tell people your full name. People knowing your name doesn't give them power over you. It only gives them power over you if you let them. If you don't care, their power disappears, right? You gotta learn to let go. Relax. It's all right. Me and Kasuth are buddies. It's like you have buddies. We discuss things. It'll be fine. <sighs> fine. Also, Davian is very nervous now that you're gonna mess with us, which I think is also very funny. <laughs> if you did. That's pretty funny. Wait, me, me messing with him or? Yeah, it kind of, like, mm, he was saying that Kasuth told him I had asked you questions about it. Mm -hmm. And then, that made him nervous that you two know each other because oh, I see you see you see what I mean right he doesn't like it he's very very enough he's very nervous about it well how about we make a little deal then princess okay next time you get sick of him you know he annoys you pisses you off just let me know okay all right I like that Sounds just good. I'm sorry this is okay. Us with your name. I'm, I'm, it, it probably operates differently here than it did at home. It does. I still haven't adjusted think of it. it think well. of it this way, yeah? I grant you powers. Mm. I know a lot about you. Mm. Kasuth and I are, are very similar in that front. What you are to me, Davian is to him. Or, well, he's a candidate. Kasuth and Davian. I discuss things. Yeah. And that's where that stops. I trust him. Plus, okay. what's he going to gain from telling any anybody the name of, 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 of some random person that nobody else really knows? True. It's not like they have inherent powers here. They exactly. Know. You worry too much. I'm Let not used go. to the rules of this plane yet. It, it's it's kind of hard to figure out which ones apply from home and which ones don't. Well, I can help you with that a little bit. Um, just take all the rules you had back back home. Yeah. Get rid of them. All of well, them? Okay. Not all of them. Okay. Say 75%. Okay. Things on the Prime Material Plane work very differently. Um, as long as you, you know, know how to behave in public, nobody really cares about what you do behind closed doors. 
as long as you don't get caught. Yeah. <laughs> so far, I've been very good at not getting caught. I've been watching. <laughs> Davian also mentioned something that I hadn't thought about, which feels stupid. What? But he's nervous about what Kasuth will want from him in exchange for the power. Mm-hmm. And he asked me what I gave you in exchange. And I realized that I had never done that or promised anything. You have. Have I? Yes. You gave me your friendship, your loyalty. Oh, yeah. And say the day comes where I do need your help because I'm in danger. Then obviously, I would All help. Right. There you go. Okay, I feel better now. It's just that... Me, I'm, I'm, I'm very laid back. Kosuth, he's a little more intense. Comes with the department fire. of being fire, right? Yeah. Right? I go with the flow, you know, just like let the wind carry me, if you will. But when push comes to shove, and I call on you in a more official manner, I do expect you to answer the call. Don't get me wrong. But I don't really have any doubts in my mind that you would or wouldn't. Yeah, I wouldn't ignore you. That's mean. Exactly. But Suth will expect the same thing from Davian. The only thing is... Davian has to prove himself first. Hence this test. Yeah, it makes sense. I still think calling them tears is, is kind of stupid, considering he's a fire elemental. Well, you know. Let's just say that us elementals, you know, a bit of irony goes a long way with us. That's true. Anything else? No, that's it. <laughs> All right. Take care. Bye. And he kind of just like in this like puff of blue smoke, just. <laughs> All right. And I, I go to bed. <laughs> All right. Hello. Hello. Hello, oh, Stoko. It's just Soko. He doesn't know. Oh, Soko. Because Soko always looks like besides <coughs> oh, shit, he can't hear his shit. Shit. I mean, he's looking at his other monitor right now, surely. Is he? Does he have two? What else could he be looking at right now? Is there just like a <laughs> like a, <laughs> a, a self portrait to one side that he's just like staring into? <laughs> it's a mirror. <laughs> I'd, I'd be I wouldn't be surprised if he was staring at his reflection. I'm lost no, in the south, I, I, bro. I, 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 I just didn't uh, score work on my second screen. Oh. Okay. How dare you. Right, so. I know, dude. You wake up that all in just... this communal room the next morning, feeling well rested, ready to seize the day. What is it you guys oh, carpe want diem. to do? I smell the morning. Smell the morning. Mm. Nice. Fuck, you did it first. <laughs> you fucking farted. Where's what the does the morning smell like? <laughs> We're still at the top, uh, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Kes is already downstairs. I go downstairs to find Kes and get some food. I don't know why, mm -hmm. but I always picture us sleeping on the floor for some reason. Like, we're in an inn. Like, we have beds. But in my mind, I'm, like, I'm not... on a bedroll on the floor in the room. Of the I'm not going to lie. For, for I have Davian, the same floor. That wouldn't surprise me. Like, if he I'm just, so like, to voluntarily lay on the floor. I, I know I have the thought that Kes has to step over like three of us to get out every like in order to get done first. And I don't know why I have that thought we as were, well. We all rented like, one room, four, but we didn't ask for extra beds. Like, yeah. Brooks like, in I, one I, bed. I imagine like three people in beds and three people on floor. I don't know why. why? Just, what dude, the hell? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I don't... I, ju I just had this realization like that oh we we're in beds because the yeah. last time we did this i would when i got up early and went to talk to Cass, like i was picturing myself lying on the floor and get, getting up i don't know okay. um yeah i'll climb out of bed onu you know a little curled up you know beak tucked under his wing whatever at the end of my bed i'll give him a 
a little nudge and, uh, you know, put, put my cloak on or whatever and head downstairs, order some, some brekkie. All right. Just for me, though. Just I will do yeah. a little bit of praying to change my spell list. Ooh. Is this session 10? Yes. Because yeah, session 10. Fucking hell. I prepared some spells. <laughs> Some real some real mean spells last session, boys. Oh really? Oh god. Alright. So eventually you all make your way downstairs. Davian is already having having some breakfast. Um because he just ordered for himself. Is Kess having any food while the rest of the party is uh, coming down? She has already eaten, but she is drinking tea and has poured a little bit out onto a saucer for Hawthorne. <laughs> I can't Hawthorne's hold the gonna, cup. Hawthorne just kind of sits there and looks looks at you. I don't have another cup. Yeah, but I don't really need. You know. That's true. If if Hawthorne doesn't drink it, I come down and I'll just sit down and start drinking it. <laughs> saucer when okay. we get there. Like, do you pick the saucer up or just like a cat licking the saucer? Nope, nope, cat style. <laughs> I always forget we're in Southwold, right? Yes. 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 yes, yes, yes. And it's the twenty fifth of Umes. Twenty seventh. Twenty seventh. Yep. Yeah. I was horribly off last session then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, first was when we saw the Sidra's blood. We were in New Derriman. That was New Derriman. Okay. Today we arrived to Southwold. Yes, yes. I will. 27th. I'll Why am down. I taking notes for? And if I see Davian, like, just seeing at the at the tavern, I'll just I'll just kind of. Are you already eating? <laughs> yeah, I got like porridge or something. I don't have know. you ordered? Have you ordered for us all, or do I? No, uh, just for myself. I didn't know what you'd all want, so. That's fair enough. It makes sense we all do it for ourselves for once. I suppose. Rather than letting one person labor all the cost. <laughs> Fucking hell, that was a coin having a stroke. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I, I, I'm quite happy with uh, simple simple breakfast. You That's know, I don't really know about sort of the. Well, you know. Yeah, I feel like Brooks is sort of, you know, probably likes like bacon or something, but. I think quite no. much. just want to do something simple today. So I'll, I might I'll, be totally wrong. You know, I don't want to jump to conclusions. That's why I only order for myself. I'll, I'll order like, like, like a cup of tea and just like real basic sort of breakfast food. Nothing too fancy. Just like real sort of like, I don't know, do croissants. You know what I mean? Like kind of croissants. 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 I'm just my croissant. I love that two people went French and everyone else was just fucking mean boys. Russian. <laughs> Got croissant. Got was, you got any of those croissants? Croissants. Croissants. I need some of them croissants. Croissants, dude. <laughs> the name of my favorite car. Croissants. What is wrong with us all today? I don't know, man. I don't know. The Hyundai oh, Croissant. To go downstairs. Right. So you all come downstairs and all individually order your breakfast and whatnot. Is there anything? Scrambled egg on toast. Is there anything being discussed while having breakfast, sitting at the table, getting ready to leave? Oh. The road to Eldalon. How long is it going to take? Two days, wasn't it? By our reckoning. Uh, this course, yes, I believe so. This course, Jack, she got a special shortcut again. I guess that's there even quicker. Oh, I think I have. Oh, I do have a friend. Okay, cool. <laughs> Last time we traveled this same road, we went past uh, uh, a burnt down settlement, right? Was that on the way to New Dharamath? Mm, wait, 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 wait. No. No, 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 that was on the way to New Dharamath. But we should keep an eye out. I mean, the fires seem to be getting closer to Eldalon. Yes, we'll keep an eye out to see if it's anybody. Might have to lend a hand. Look Obviously, I can always send no new up. Yeah. Keep an eye out for smoke. But yeah, two days on the road, which means we have to camp halfway, unless we find somewhere to stay. <coughs> last, oh, time, last time I came this way, we went to the jungle. Uh, Last time we, we set off on the 17th and arrived on the 18th, so. Yeah, well, last we left Eldalon, we went through the jungle. Yeah, and we, we went past. We went past the pool with the. That oh, pink. With the, with the, with the mm. algae. Yeah. Mm. We should probably try and grab some more of that if we can, because that was. Uh... I marked the location of the pool on the map. I think it was quite close to the edge of the jungle, if we uh, want to brave it again. I thought it was. Somewhat far in, but 
e either way, it's not that far a march. But obviously, we've got the horse and cart now. So if we stay on the road, it shouldn't. It, well, it shouldn't take us too long. But we wouldn't really be able to go into the jungle to get the uh, algae. We can always do that later. Yeah. It's not like it's far away. It is well, from Aldalon. And you just don't go is, leave is, it. Is, maybe uh, the more algae that makes Jackson is doing his map trick. Yeah, I was just I was looking to make sure I was rolling the right thing. It's a perception check. Uh, yep. Is a twenty. All right. Which passes Ooh. DC fifteen. All right. Uh, but how does it work again exactly? Uh, basically, where, where, it, actually, like, what is it called? I'll look it up and I'll actually fucking save the page. Photographer's map case. Basically, it's like you just find some random maps that are stored in there. I think is how they flavor it. Last time I gave you my map and you were like, uh, do you did a magic trick yeah, and then I dug in my. Uh, case for it but yeah mm. um so yours is a map of shortcuts correct and mine just says cartographer's map case and yeah. there's a different I mean, oh like, right yeah, yeah, yeah. it has yeah, to level up shortcuts. to a certain rank apparently and then it's either yeah, yeah, yeah. it either becomes a map of shortcuts or a map of the moment yeah it's, a, it's a both do different things right yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, well, shortcut travels reduced by half. Right. With that in mind, you reckon that if you follow the routes that you have determined, um, you'll be able to make it to Eldalon, like, before midnight tonight, if you follow your route. Um, I, I think with this new map I found, uh, the route that we would take, I don't think it's worth detouring, because we could probably make it in a day to Eldalon. Yeah. All right. Fuck the army, then. That's actually fucking sick. That cuts the travel yeah. in half. <laughs> when I saw that that was an item I could make, I was like, this is something I've never so heard So that means, like, that. if you're going on, like, say, an eight-day tre trek... It becomes four days. You can four just days. cut that into a four-day journey. Check, that's that's if you make the check. Make the check. That's insane. What the fuck? Dude, that's sick. So it's like, and That's yeah. very cool. That's some like traveling underground in fucking secret mm -hmm. tunnels. Yeah, it's one of those like weird items that you never really pay attention to until. Yeah, that's, no, that's dope as fuck. What the hell? Nice one. Our tipsters, nice. dude. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. So uh, there you have it. You'll you'll be able to get to Eldalon like a little before midnight tonight. Uh, yeah, I suppose, well, I'll I'll sort of go over the map <laughs> with with Jax quickly because obviously I'll be the one driving the the cart and I'll have a look through the, the this shortcut and mm -hmm. yeah you we can sort of ford that river here avoid meandering quite a lot yeah <laughs> I don't know how the horses will manage there but uh, it should work <laughs> seems safe <laughs> seems good enough I mean Syrian kind of looks at you uh Jackson is that another one of your inventions the map? No, I think those have been around for a while. <laughs> I was going to take credit, but yes, they're not mine. They just exist. So... I'm not quite sure how it works, to be honest with you. Are you asking about the map or the case? But the case, I guess. <gasps> oh, sorry. Hmm. Yeah, it, it seems there's a lot of, like, random maps inside and it, you just kind of if you pick out the right one great otherwise it's I, to find it. i'm gonna tap Tess on the shoulder and ask her via sign language if this or to ask the group if the shortcut means we can't go to the algae pool and just to remind them of that because i would assume that's part of what makes it shorter is not making that trip yeah. i just sign back that it means we can't get to the algae pool uh, i mean if, if you were going yeah. to the, go to the algae pool that would like the journey yeah, from south to Eldalon would already be a day and a half. That would increase it by like another like half a day easily. Yeah, when okay. when Jax mentioned the short guy, I said, "Yeah, well, we won't bother with the algae then." We okay, but we can go anytime. True. I think uh, once we arrive in Eldalon, obviously we'll show Siren around. Maybe stay for a night. I don't know if. I mean, I was probably hoping we'd stay more than a night. To be fair, um... well, well, we'll arrive at Not... night, right? Guys, then night. spend the day uh, and the night, and then hopefully, well, well leave the next. More than, I mean, day. more than that to uh, 
show around properly and get proper introductions in place and all that. So I was hoping to spend two or three days to be fair. Well, we'll be going to see... Tranlio. Tranlio, probably General Cron. <laughs> in the General Cron. In the same day. Do... do the introductions at the same time. Then do a tour of the city as well. And... It's a big, it's a big it's city, big but there's city. places that you don't need to go. You don't need to see the docks. You don't need yeah. to see... Well, you might. We might need to see the docks. We might see the docks Wait. for. Uh, why? You know. Why would she need to see the docks? Because you could implement further trade if you have people who are friends in the Adlon City docks. You can create trade networks. Right, but if she means friendly, oh, that's already other one. Other places than the dock. Yes, yeah, okay, so it's well, a good place to get familiarised with the on... entire city rather than just certain parts. Because you never know where you find yourself. Serious time crunch. Yeah, so I say we why? Can't yeah, just let. Lazarin have his Excellent. enjoyment with and spend time with Siren. I'll That's sort of true. like loop my thumb under the necklace and like dangle the gemstone from it. I mean, there's kind of a time crunch, but I suppose with the time Jack saved us, we can take another day. I say it doesn't. Is it really like... imminent, imminent time crunch? Is I it... don't mean to be a bother. Who? Hmm. Well, it's no bother. Uh, yeah, it's no bother. It's no Besides, bother, I mean... You already have one of the tiers, so even if you didn't go and find the other ones, they would be coming for you anyway. That makes ah, a very yes. good point. It doesn't matter where we are. That you really puts our mind at ease. You could just stay in Eldalon and you know, wait for them to come and try and kill you. Who knows, Devin? You, Someone you could said, already you need... be after you as we speak at this time. Exactly. Moment. And then you all have to... <laughs> What? <laughs> what's that? What's that Dutch? Nothing. Huh? What's that Dutch? <laughs> so, so, whoever, <laughs> if someone has the other tier or tiers, <laughs> they still need your one, right? Yes. So, in which case, they, <laughs> surely there's no time crunch because you either get to where it is and it's there, or it's not, and we find the person where they and beat the shit out of it. I oh, much like sooner to be the person to have two already than the person who only has one. <laughs> if we all have one, and you, I don't know how good my odds are, so maybe with two I'll grow more powerful, and that way... Oh, that we can well, do. has the one you're, that you're you have already just... made you powerful? I mean, I was able to conjure a bird the day after I found it. But yeah. it, you, you think that's it. because you found the tear? I'm not ruling it out. They're going to be so much stronger have, with two birds. I would have thought that One it would have there. been... If it was related to the tear, it would have been like a phoenix or something. There was Rather far than... involved in... Lol, I'm muted. Uh, <laughs> I also tap Kess when she says that in sign. Um, plus, we all got new abilities around the same time. Oh. And not all of us touch the tear. Uh, like, I can summon these arms now. <laughs> I'll repeat what she says. I can turn See? myself into a tree. That's really cool. Sure, I, I just made new I stuff. Just hit, I just hit things. <laughs> I just prayed super hard. I got hold on. <laughs> well, but can we really, really say that that wasn't somehow related to the stone? So... Probably. Regardless, I, I don't think an extra day is going to... No, like I said, I mean, Jax has already saved us pretty much a whole day's worth of travel. I just like a last one too. Besides, it, the more time in Eldalon, I, also have stuff to do I can maybe do some reading, maybe yeah. find out a little more about what I'm actually doing. Will we Very arrive in Eldalon to too late stuff. tonight to go to the dance hall? Probably. No. Well, it depends on well, the dance hall. You know, uh, some dance halls uh, open very, very late. <laughs> yeah, we might arrive at, like, say, midnight, but then, you know, that's when they start to charge two gold to get in rather than just five silver, and that's really awful, unless you're... But, you know. <laughs> There's always that one dance hall that, uh, that opens after all the other dance halls, so then when everyone's kicking out of the others, you will go to that one dance hall that's open to, like, six... Yeah, the but then they always charge ludicrous amounts for <laughs> drinks in that dance hall because it's open so late and everyone wants more drinks, so... It's a well, uh, we which might is why you get absolutely it. fucking plastered before and you set up. It is off. fine commerce business to find that niche in the market. Uh, and I'll besides, I got all these new fancy Dune's coins. Find a niche so in your market. I'm sure I can afford what? it. 
Because, you know, you're, you'll be trading very rare goods and, or, or, you know, from the jungle, from the continent. What's Goods that people have never seen before. A niche is like a little... Corner. Like, yeah, like a corner, like a, a gap where there's not really so um, almost like anything in it. Specialized, you could also say. It is um, usually a small sort of... For trading skins, it's usually a small group. Corners. Who would want to buy it, but then you, it, because it's such a small group, you can charge high prices because it's something they want. So, if I get this correct, then there's a lot of rangers and guides out there, but my niche is I know the jungle. Yes, right. Well, that's the one thing, but I'm more talking about sort of your people in general. You yeah, have you, well, you can access and knowledge. You want to. To things completely unheard of or hard to come by outside of this continent in particular. So your expertise. I think I understand. Say there's a flower, which I, I would know because I'm a ranger and I've been here a while. There is a flower <laughs> from this continent in particular, in the sort of the, the western reaches, the eastern reaches. Western. Where's Febra's for thing? A fabric's footing is east. The eastern reaches, there's a flower that we've learned um, can be powerfully uh, anti-toxic uh, or anti-venom. We've only found it here. So, you know, there might be something like that that you would know and, and you know, have access to more than anyone else um, outside of the continent. And therefore... It'll be incredibly high value until, of course, uh, inevitably the trade companies tear down half the jungle and build mines and everything becomes commonplace. And, uh, huh? yeah, well, you know, you never know. Um, <laughs> the fuck? have you seen Fern Gully? It's a really yeah, good movie. Hey, yeah. Great movie. I was actually going to say, and then a bat and a man <clears throat> come, you know, top it off, but yeah. So. Let's hope that Is doesn't a happen. <laughs> I don't know what that is. I'm a woodsman. Davian, would you mind if I um, sit up front with you again on the cart? Uh, possibly, but if I need to consult Jack. Jack, can I just have that map from you? Uh, yes, of course. Okay, perfect. Then, yeah, no worries. I need a whole map case. Oh. I will say that for the purposes of this. He can like Pringles too. He can. He can. I was saying it's a magic item I make. Anyone can use it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but we'll say for the purpose of this, like he doesn't need the whole case. You you pull the map out. Oh, there for yeah, the map yeah. now is, and you can just give the map to Davian. It's fine. Yay! Yay! Well, well then, should we hit the road? Mm. Finish our breakfast. Nom 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 nom. Right. Don't right. have anything for the road, do we? No, I think we're we We did most of our shopping in New Down. All right. Just slowly heard Onu out of the door. <laughs> and then as you, um, just as you gesture leave, him to take flight. Jolly kind of gives you, all, gives you all a nod as you leave. Don't be a stranger. See you next time. Take care. The solid crow. Mm. Weird you name. leave, go back to the stables where your horses and carts are in caramel, right? Yep. Mm. Our, uh, yeah. Thunder and lightning. Yeah, yeah. Are, are stabled. <laughs> They're not and, war horses. Uh, you arrive and they look very well taken care of, uh, well fed. They're, they're still kind of like numbing on some on some food so since, since it's still early in the morning. Um, and before you know it, you're off on the road following the shortcut. Did we pay, or do we pay after? I forget. Um, I think we already paid. A good question, and a DM forgot, so I'll just let you off. I know that Jolly Yay. said that we could have food and drinks on the house as a gift. I'm talking for the horses, but oh, can I... Horses. I think we already paid. Yeah. Can I get a bag of feed from them as well? Um, bag of feed for two horses will last you about a week. That's uh, about two gold for a bag. <sighs> We're only going to be on the road for a day before they're stabled again. Do you do anything smaller than that? Like just a feed bag or something? Oh, I suppose so. Uh, keep them fed for the day. When they've had food now, if, you, if you're going to be at your destination, you know, before the end of the day, as long as you feed them tonight, you'll be all right, you know? 
Uh, you think so? I mean, it's going to be a full day. I'll uh, tell you what. I'll, 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 I'll give you a little, give you a little, little something, something. Um, just, just toss us two silver, and uh, I'll, I'll make sure that there's. Uh, I'll put some. I'll put some in the back of the cart for you to, to feed him. Oh, can you break a gold? Yeah, of course. Perfect. Remove one gold, add eight silver. All right. Thank you kindly. Hey, no worries. And I'll, I'll hop up front <clears throat> and uh, get us going out of the out of the, the town with the Siren alongside me. All right. And as you travel, um, is Onu just constantly flying overhead? Yes. Uh, specifically, I wanted to keep an eye out for like smoke on the horizon to the south. Okay. 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 Uh, give me a second. And oh, I really need a stat block again. With what Davian said about the fires, I also feel like maybe every like twenty-ish minutes or thirty-ish minutes, I'd just be like giving the air uh, a whiff and using my sense of smell to see if I smell any smoke that we might not see yet. Make a perception check. <clears throat> Should I make one for Onu as well? Uh, yes. I have to make room on my desk. I'll give Onu dice. advantage because of the fact that he has. Like, Ooh. he is up, up high and has a really good position to look around and scan for that sort of th thing. 21. <clears throat> 21. Nice. Hold on, I'm trying to figure out if he's actually proficient in anything. It will specify if he is. Yeah. Yeah. It says what his proficiency bonus is. Now, the way that works with, like, stat blocks for, like, creatures and stuff, it'll just say, like, there'll be, like, a line that says skill proficiencies if, they're, if they are mm -hmm. there. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I'll just give you a plus. Oh, God. Oh. Just fuck both those dice. Okay. With a plus two, that is a dirty 20. Nice. Right. Um, Daigon, you start, like, this is about halfway through your journey. Mm hmm. Uh, you, you smell, and you definitely send, you, you, you can smell the scent of, of, of something burning. And at that same exact time, okay. Onu, <laughs> Onu kind of, like, alerts you, Davian. Uh, that there is definitely a fire uh, nearby. Uh, Can I okay. smell which direction the the like it this this it's coming from? Uh, yeah, you're all pretty high, so I'd say yeah, you can you can definitely and Onu kind of also making noises and like pointing himself in that direction. Uh, it's it's towards your southwest, like towards. Okay, the then city, I'll just I'll just start pointing southwest. <clears throat> And um, point to my nose. All right. Yep. Yeah. Onu spotted far as well towards the city, so hopefully it won't slow our pace too much to go and find it. I'm not sure how yeah. far away though. Uh, you travel for about another thirty minutes, and as you kind of like go like go down uh, the tip of a hill, you suddenly see that down the road there is a farmhouse set ablaze. Just like a lone farmhouse. Um, yeah, like a lone farmhouse. Some some yeah. fields of crops around it. Um, set on fire. Not completely like like proper. Like it's not a done deal. This seems to be like relatively recent. Um, mm -hmm. And as you get closer, roll another perception check for Onu. Advantage again? Yeah. No. No. Just just struggle. Okay. Another dirty 20. Another dirty 20. Nice. He alerts you again. And kind of Davian procs you to like look to see where he's looking. And you can see uh, a group of four cloaked individuals kind of making their way away from the house. How far away at a, at a glance? <clears throat> uh, I, too far for you to catch up, but you can make note of the direction they're headed. How far? How far? Fuck. Um, In feet. Just know if I could shoot him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, probably over a thousand. I'm going to shoot. About half a mile minimum. Oh, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Okay. What the fuck is hot? Ha okay, that's like... In feet? <laughs> How many feet uh, are like in a mile? A lot. A lot. A lot. 2,600 feet. Yep. So they're 1,300 feet away. No. No, half a mile is twenty six hundred feet. Oh, okay, 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 yeah. okay. Yeah, okay. like you can see them, and you can see the direction that they're headed out. because of the, your positioning. But um, oh, oh, 
Uh, 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 fuck. I'm going to look back into the cart and I'm just going to say, who here has ridden a horse before? I have. I mean, I, I raise my hand. Out. Not one that I purchased. I'll point at yeah. Diagon. Okay. Diagon, hop on Pepper and I will hop onto Caramel and I will unhitch both the horses. Okay. And I'm going to pursue it. And kind of, <laughs> like, embraces herself. Well, the cat's just going to go, like, good to, like yeah. straight forward, but... <laughs> if it's surging send... the front, it's going to go... Yeah, she's on the front, she's like, oh! <laughs> I'm going to send Hawthorne with uh, Diagon. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I, I, as, as I start to ride after them, follow us I on foot as follow. fast as you can, we'll try and slow them down. I don't even know if they have saddles. My balls are getting wrecked. <laughs> and there's no saddles on them, no. Oh, oh, I'll, like, we... I'll like let, I'll stand on it. Bareback. I mean, is can I rough. Dutch? Yes. Dutch, Ooh. can you tell me? Can I try and do some some Body. some monk monk shit acrobatics to try and go right on hitching, grab Kess and get Kess on the horse with me? Because also we've done this before in our backstory. We have a sure, specific horse theft Keep it in mind incident. that it would slow the horse down. Like you won't be as fast as the horse is having. No, I know. That's fine. I have, another, light, I, have, right? I have another plan. That's fine. I just want to okay. get Cass on the horse with me. You're gonna look at. I'll like, roll Jackson for it. Yeah, yeah. Make a check. <sighs> Why is this fastest fucking person in the group? Make oh, an acrobatics check. Oh, really? I'm funny. getting there. I'm getting there. Hold on. Uh, that's a 18. <laughs> Stop interfering. Uh, I mean, Kess, you, 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 you okay. feel Daigon kind of, like, grabbing you. Like, do you resist, or are you just like, okay? I'm just going with it. Okay. Yep. And okay. then, once she's on the horse, uh, I have her in front of me, because she's shorter than me. So mm -hmm. we're going. I'm following Davian, and, uh, I, with only, like, one hand in the reins, and the other I use to sign, and I say, I'm fast, I'll follow, and I give her the reins, and I jump off. Okay. So the horse I'm, can I'm go fast with one person, and I'm the speediest in the group. Okay, I'm just. Yeah, how fast can you speediest. fucking move again? Uh, in, in, in if turn, I use if if I use step of the wind and my vaxi feline agility, because what's step of you, step of the wind? You don't need to step of the wind. You don't need to step of the wind. If you're, you're say that run out real quick. Using your action. Oh, Otherwise, you okay. just burn your key points away. Then I can move 160 60. feet every six seconds. Okay. With that step of the okay. wind, god damn. Oh, shit. Step of the wind just lets you do it as a bonus action instead of Yeah, action. no, I'm still using step of the wind. It's just since we're not in combat turn, I'm just like kind of doing it. Now Onu's flight speed is uh sixty feet, which means you can move 120 feet. If I don't use step of the wind, it's eighty feet every six seconds. Have a look. That's still a lot. Yeah, <laughs> that's a lot. So what, how is, if you don't use you step, step of the wind? 60, I think. Hold on. You've got uh, your feet. Right? Yeah, 60 feet. 60 uh, feet. Yeah. Diagon is faster than a horse, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's why I jumped Almost off the horse and like Kess do it. As your horses. Yeah, I don't know what you told so her Diagon to get on the horse. Fucking <laughs> no, wait, wait, no, no, no. The horse will move 120 feet. It yeah, speed is 60 feet, but if you use an action to dash, it'll go 120. Right, right. Yeah, but Diagon is still a little faster. Yeah, some uh, fucking how. Somehow. So <laughs> Diagon just darts forward. Okay, so you are guys you... are in pursuit. You'll make yep. it to the house. What, at about like a minute? With that speed, I think, give or take? I'm going to straight towards the guy. The guy's fleeing. Yeah, okay, so you'll... Yeah, but I'm mm -hmm. just for sake of this. Yeah, what okay. What is the rest of the... What are you? the other three doing? Uh, I will look I will look at the other two there. that have been left. I'm going... I just kind of look like... Where did they go? I mean, surely it wouldn't it be fast if we're still in the sh cart? We should and just watch the walking? cart. No, I think the cart's gone. I think this is. Uh, there's nothing like we didn't store anything in the cart, but like the feed right away. Right? No. Um, I'll kind of pick up. I mean, the... it, I'll be impressed if someone can steal a cart without any horses on it. But so then, I think we are following as far behind as we can. I don't understand why we're far. not in the cart, but okay. And you do I? I should want to get that slightly faster, but I think we better. I guess we'll be group. there to bury yeah. their bodies. It's fine. Listen, DM said they were too far away to catch up. I'm sorry. Okay? Can't hear you. True. Yeah, can't you're not there. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Crazy. It's, it's like it's almost as if I wasn't the talking about that. But I don't have a body. It's so good. I will dance on your dead bodies. Anyway, I will I will start to like not run, jog. Now jog. Horty jog. Horty jog. 
Okay, let's keep up cross country. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, I will like leave. Okay, so hi, knees. Hi, knees. For the sake of this, you'll Hold you'll on. make it to the house that is on fire in a few minutes. So that's fine. The party is now split. Yeah. Davian, uh, oh, Daigon, no. and Kes are in pursuit. Oh, going <coughs> past the burning house. Yep. Chasing in the, the direction people. of the cloaked individuals. And because of that, mm -hmm. once you kind of dive into some shrubbery and some, some tree lines that they also mm -hmm. dove into, you can see. Mm -hmm. um, and this is just you three. Mm -hmm. That they are in the process of casting a spell. There's a chalk circle being drawn. Runes are oh. being... I... Uh, are being, are how being, far away? Like... Uh, from, from where you are, they're about, they're about like 90 feet away. Okay, I want to cast Mage Armor on myself and then Eldritch Blast them. To disrupt them. Okay. Can I Hunter's Mark and shoot? Yeah, I'll give you, I'll give you three, like one action uh, before okay. I get into initiative. Oh, oh, so I can't Hunter's Mark and shoot then. Uh, I'll mm -hmm. give you a turn. Sorry, I'll give you a turn. Uh, uh, so there are four of them. Yes, there are four of them. Oh my god! Oh my god! I need music. Uh, okay. Oh, um, we're outnumbered. Here we go. Well, I mean, yeah, like I'll just hunt as much whichever's closest, and I will lose a freaking arrow at that man. Wait, okay. ninety feet? I just got to check the. Range of my longbow, because that might... I think it's 150 and 600, so it should be fine. Okay. That's a 16 to hit. Give me a second. Mm-hmm. While I get my bearings. Mm. I have so many tabs open, it is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, 16 does hit. All right. But... And the boot. Uh, 12 points of piercing damage. 12 points of piercing damage, alright. Yes? <clears throat> I rolled 21 to hit. That hits. Uh, which one are you hitting? Um. Like, are you all peppering the same person, or are you just kind of... Uh, is there anyone who looks to be, like, in charge? Of the ritual, one of the I mean? From the others. Make a perception <laughs> check. <laughs> okay. I'll jump down off the horse as well, just like slide off it and like Hunter's Mark. Rail him. Dirty 20 to find out if something's wrong. As far as you can tell, they all look pretty like similar. They're, they're, they're wearing the same robes. You can't see their okay. faces. Uh, I'm going to hit a different one. Okay. Um, and that's eight Caleb damage. Falls. Plus, oh. yeah. Uh, plus, uh, Genius Wrath, so two Thunder damage as well. Ooh. Thunder, so very nice. Okay. Dagon. How far away did you say they are once we we're feet. seeing this? 90 I can... Okay, let me know. Now we're in a proper turn order. So if I dashed as my action, that puts me at 80. And then we'll burn... The so feline agility, so I can get there, and then I no, it's not, I don't want to get there. I want to be 80 feet, I want to be 10 feet away. That's perfect. So I will use my action to dash, mm -hmm. and then my bonus action is to summon the spiritual arms, my arms of astral self. Okay, and if I'm in 10 feet, they need to make a dex save. Oh, this is the frightened thing, right? Yeah, no, they just take force damage from just like oh. as the, like the, the force energy That's coming off wild. the arms being summoned. That's uh, sick. Just like, <laughs> natural 20, natural 19, natural so 16, natural like... 1. Jesus. Okay, so only the natural 1 is gonna <laughs> gonna make that, I'm pretty sure. Those are some um, old anime chakra release, where there's just like a my... force wave. Yeah, because my DC at this point is only 12, it's That's not great. Persona shit. Uh, but one of them is, is? gonna take... Uh, Zero damage. Is it two two d four two d? Hold on, where is it? Where to go? There's so many things on my sheet. Okay, two d four. <laughs> so one of them takes seven force damage Ooh, from the energy coming off my arms. Yeah, four Alrighty. and three. 
And with that, um, that's cool that's my start, turn. Dude, just like, they all yell in um, something in Draconic, which I don't think any of you speak. No. Nope. Uh, roll initiative, please. Yay! Okay, okay. We don't, we don't even need because we're like no, a minute plus you're, you're, you're walking, you're going. Like, yeah. it's all, yeah. Also, <laughs> oh, no. they don't, it depends on your, a Dutch might have to make a call on perception check, because will you just go to the house to get the going, or did they see yeah, us by kind the time of we gotta, following? Gotta, they're they're, they're, they're half a mile it. away. They're half a you mile away. Minutes, yeah. We're literally two minutes away. It takes away. like seconds. ten minutes away before you can get no, into I'm the house. No, I'm just saying, dude, until either you guys are dead or they are. It doesn't it matter either way, Laura. It doesn't matter. Because by the time we get there, even if we see you, combat, combat will be over. Oh, regardless. Yeah. Yeah. It will oh, take you okay. about 30 seconds <laughs> This is to why we thought this was dumb. Because well, we literally it's cannot now. get there. It's too late. This is turns of six seconds. We're I mean, about you know, ten minutes away. Better? You know what's even better? We have the two people who almost died last fight, and none of the healers with us. Yep. <laughs> yep. Healers plural. Pepe last. I'm so. <gasps> hey, um, I count. I count Jax as a healer. Okay, that's true. Life. That's true. That's true. That's true. I forgot about so that. Bad. I I don't know how I forgot Jax as healer. We kept <laughs> all the three slowest people just away. Jokes on you guys. Man. I'm leaving the old man and the cleric in the dust. Jokes <laughs> 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 is just like. <laughs> Full We're fucking month mode. Old man. You, you, you said you were jogging and not running, and I'm faster than you. I mean, so it's more just like I mean, the imagery. It's flavor. It's flavor. Like I'm it's, it's, it's flavor. He's still moving it. 120 feet or whatever, 60 feet. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm initiative, uh, Dagen, Kess, uh, Davian, initiatives, please. Every six seconds, I'm. I got 12. From you. 12. I got 15. 15. I also got 12. Okay. Uh, which one is I next? The... We have exactly the same decks, so you can go first, Dragon. Okay. Me? Uh, Ono has the same speed as the horses, so he, he's flying out overhead as well, just so you know. Okay. All right. Uh, the wizard um, hit oh. with uh, the fucking arrow. It's going to get up, turn around. He's going to cast, say some words in Draconic and cast Agonazar's Scorcher. Oh, that sounds nice. real. A line shit. of roaring good, flames, thirty though. feet no, oh. thirty feet long and five feet wide, yeah. uh, emanates oh, no. from him in the direction he chooses. Uh, is it, it's a deck save. Davian and Kess remained at range, but Daigon went all in. Right, like she went. Well, yeah. in. I I don't got range. She's ten feet away. <laughs> what yeah. I do. Yeah, so I'm ten feet away. Yeah, it's a thirty foot long line, so only that Daigon will be hit by this. Uh, Daigon, it is a deck save though. You know. Okay. It's a six spell. I love okay. That's a 15? 15. I'm gonna have that in the Halloween one shot and I'm excited. Uh, Ooh. 15. Let me quickly check what this guy's fucking DC is. Hold on. Oh, his DC is 15, dude. Ooh, you just made the save. Oh. <laughs> uh, you take half damage instead of full damage. Good, I'm squishy. Too much don't have evasion yet. <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, Four levels. You take 10 points of fire damage. Ah! Oh god, oh god, oh fuck, oh, sh <laughs> oh fuck, oh, oh shit, that's half damage, guys. That's half damage, guys. <laughs> oh no. Um, Davian, it is your turn. Uh, I shoot oh, Scorching Man and fucking Onu comes down as well. Okay. Uh, the shot is a 17 to hit. 17 hits, yep. Yep. You said this is the one who was hit by the arrow, right? So he's the yes. one with Hunter's Mark. Uh, yeah. That's uh, 12 points of piercing damage. 12 points of piercing damage. Ooh, okay. And Onu is going to come down and shred his ass. Is it 12 points of damage, is... right? Yes. 12 points of piercing damage. Very nice. All right. Uh, let me see. Uh, my spell attack modifier. Okay. What the fuck is my spell attack? Okay. <laughs> Ah, only 10 to hit for Onu, unfortunately. It's unfortunately. So Onu but, swoops in, uh, but he manages to just duck under Onu as Onu fucking... Sh yeah, and he can just fly 30 feet back up. Mm -hmm. <sighs> All right. Is that your turn? Oh, man. Yes. Diagonal. Oh, actually, wait, oh. no. Uh, I want to leave my horse, and I want to run 30 foot, like, to, to, to the side, so that I'm not sort of clumped up with my horse. Okay. So staying at the same range from them, but just like moving around. Alrighty. Um, Daigon. Um, uh, I will use my physical arms to grab my spear and attack with my spear. Okay. Uh, on whatever one 
hit me with the fire. Yeah, hit him. Oh no, my Discord's like fucked up. Hello? Hmm. Hello? Yeah, the having Hello? problems. Yeah, my Discord did a thing. Okay. I will use my spear. So my physical arms are holding my spear, and then I have my astral arms just doing their own thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna attack. Attack the one. Zenyatta shit. Yeah. Is the one mm -hmm. who set the yeah, fire like... different from the one who was shot with the arrow? No. Sorry? Same guy. No, same dude. Same, same guy? Dude. Yeah. Oh, then yeah. Attack him. Attack that fuck. Please oh, roll good. That rolled off my thing. Um. Oh, that's a 18. That's okay. 18 to hit? Yeah. That hits? Hell yeah. So <coughs> go for us, big ol' s- Oh, and I rolled max damage. That's nine points of, what is, what type of damage is that? Slashing, piercing, piercing, piercing damage. Okay, okay. And then bonus action, flurry <laughs> of blows, because I feel like we need to try and whittle them down fast because we're at a disadvantage. Um, actually, that's a lie. Bonus action, patient defense, because I'm the only one up close and there's four of them. Yeah, good call. Okay. Good call. So that your turn? Yes. Kess. Okay, I'm gonna pull up, so I'm 80 feet away, and then just, um, that's how far I'm going. Pull up! Pull up, <laughs> pull up. Pull up, pull up. Okay, I'm gonna bonus action cast Hex on the same guy I attacked the first time. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna make him have disadvantage on wisdom. Okay, okay. Uh, and then I'm gonna Eldritch Blast. Eldritch Blast. Whee. Eldritch Blast. Okay. Uh, that was 17 to hit. That hits. <clears throat> With... Nice. Five force damage. Uh, four necrotic. And two thunder. Very nice. Okie dokie. Is that your turn? Yep, that's my turn. Alright, one of the wizards is going to- Oh, by the way, um, Hawthorne also rolled a 12. Oh. Um, he's still where I am, I suppose. Uh, you, you, you told him to hang on to Diagon, right? So that's yeah, why yeah, he's yeah. technically- so actually he's, in, he's in range. Um, so he's just gonna shoot a bolt. <laughs> Hit him for one damage, right? <laughs> Hopefully, if he... every little, every little bit helps, hey, man. man. Yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm waiting for the health. time where we're fucking Hawthorne's gonna Hawthorne get the killing blow with one damage. Oh, <laughs> I'd be so pissed. Uh, that's twenty-one to hit. Mm -hmm. You hit the same. Uh, dude? Yep. Okay. They gotta make a Constitution save. All right. That's why I do natural it. Natural two. Just... That's not gonna fucking happen. Yes. Okay, cool. So now he's poisoned. Ooh. Yes! For a minute. He's going to attack rolls and same throws. Uh, what is exactly is his throw with modifiers? His what? What exactly save. is the save with modifiers? What? Two, because he has a plus zero to plus <gasps> yes! He's unconscious. Oh, for a minute. What? Oh, yeah. For a Hell minute? Yeah. Unconscious? Holy fuck. Unconscious. Okay. Okay. What? Thank God. We're, we have Dude, a okay. Our odds just got so much better. Oh shit! Okay, Boy. he's All he's right. poisoned and he's unconscious. Is that because like he the will... has to be under a certain number or something? Yeah, if it's under five, he's unconscious. That's he's crazy. poisoned and he, until he takes damage or is shaken awake, he stays asleep. Fuck. Okay. So don't damage oh. sleeping men. Don't don't damage him. Unless you're gonna kill him. All right. Yeah. So is that your turn, Cass? And yep. Hawthorne. All right. Um. So Davian. You're 90 yes. feet away still? Yes. Beside you, 10 feet, you said, is one of the horses? Right? 30 you, feet. 30 I feet. moved as far from my, my horse as I could move, yeah. Okay. Kess moved up 10. Mm hmm. Man, once you use five, it's 20 so foot sphere. <laughs> oh. Mm. <laughs> radius or diameter? 20 foot radius sphere. Mm. That means it's 40 feet. This is less cool than I thought. <laughs> Would be able to hit Davy and Kess and that horse. Correct? Okay. Oh, the horse! Oh, you're no. the horse! I don't know how close Kess and I were to each other. I guess pretty close when we pulled up. Yeah. I then moved 30 feet. She moved 10 feet. She moved 10 feet up. Yeah, I mean, that means her horse feet. might also. Yeah, that I might be two horses. Four, but... I think all four, like the two horses. Like, anyone not being hit here is dying, I think. 
yeah. as this wizard For casts once. fireball. <laughs> Yo, counter spell shoots out of the palm of this guy's hand and grows in size as it travels. I need everyone, including the two horses, to make a deck save. Should I roll for the horses or? Uh, I'll roll for the horses. Okay. Horses should the, just run. Fuck it. I have run the away. stat block open. So. Uh, so do I, Dutch. Okay, so... well then you roll, bitch. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You roll. I guess sorry. I can just call Dutch the glue factory now. I rolled a natural twenty. Oh. Nice. Okay. I didn't. <laughs> horses I'm both rolled so uh, sixteen and seventeen, respect uh, respectively. So. I'm gonna take more damage than the fucking horses. <laughs> <laughs> Deck yeah, saving yeah. throw. Yeah, I got a 12. Yeah, but you also have a lot more HP than the horses, let me tell you. Yes. I, well, <laughs> not a whole lot more. <laughs> Fuck. <clears throat> this okay. is not good. Well, here we go. Oh, please don't fucking kill me. Our horses are gonna die. I swear to fucking God. What horses have 13 HP. 12. Okay, so you do, you're gonna take full damage here. And if it's enough, if it's enough to knock me out, it gets the horses too. So. <laughs> no. Um. Man. Okay. Davian. Take twenty points of fire damage. Horses are fine. Ooh. Horses and Kes take ten. Points of fire Ten? damage. That's Ten. Five. Yeah, because you made a okay. save. So the horses have two HP <laughs> each. <laughs> Fucking hell. Holy shit, dude. Split the party, oh, they said. Um, split the party. That's his turn. Um, I mean, these might have just been your basic <laughs> bitch arsonists for all we knew. Like, <laughs> well, I've run across them oh. before, but we'd put them all to sleep and then carry them in chains to the fucking town. So even... Davian didn't really know if they were dangerous. The wizard uh, that uh, is put to sleep. Does he have a turn at all, or is he just is he just unconscious and that's he's it? He's just unconscious. Just unconscious. That's lit, dude. All right, then he's gonna skip his turn naturally. Um, finally, the wizard struck by uh, the like fucking summoning of the arms. Oh, nice. Is going to burning hands. Close. Oh, they're all very fire. <laughs> We should get some fire resistant shit if we're Actually, gonna go after arsonists. <laughs> yeah, burning hands probably... is a good shot. It's gonna cast burning hands on you, uh, Dagon. Duke, why'd you say? <laughs> because, right. Fuck's sake, Duke. I'll explain. Does uh, Hawthorne have to make a save? <laughs> uh, yes. Against, um. Is it dex save? Oh. For you as well, uh, Dagon. Dex save. Okay. See, if I plan the thought of using Burning Aww. Hands, he's not going to use another fireball and inevitably um, kill me and the horses. So. 14. 14? Not going to make it. Does not make the save. No. Um, mm -mm. I'm screwed. But it's a Hawthorne roll? Dirty 20. That makes the save. He takes, what, half damage or not at all? Oh, no. All right, half on a successful save. Yeah, so half damage. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no. Dutch, no. No max damage, please. No! Minimum damage! Yes! yes dude! Nice. I rolled three ones on my 3d6s. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, no. So, uh, that's three damage the on that again. To live. And that is, I guess, one damage on half four. He's fine! What the fuck? <laughs> He's still up! Fuck, man! He's now on half health. That's crazy. Alright, I mean, that's his turn. Uh, oh, shit. Wizards. We have two health. <laughs> The wizard being like, uh, having been peppered by a bunch of arrows and all the other bullshit, <laughs> is going to look at Kess. Because this is the guy that, that, that just got, is, is, he's looking very rough. Oh man. He's going to look at Kess and he's going to cast. He's the one I attacked. Oh. Yeah, no, this is the one that, no. that, 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 got, got Davian kept fucking oh, Okay, 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 cool. Just checking. And he's going to... Mm. Move up. Make sure that Kess is in range of his uh, Agonazar's Scorcher. Does, does he get an attack of opportunity from me? Because if I no. was in melee, I don't know how many of the group. Oh, okay. No. Darn. Uh, he's going to make sure Next that Kess is in range of his Agonazar's Scorcher. Come on, me, he, You're going to be the only target that he'll be able to hit with that uh, from his angle. 
So Do I need it. you to make a dex save, guess. Dude, I took 10 damage on a save from this, so... Okay, Please I got... Roll good. I, I rolled uh, a 17, nice. which is... Yeah, you, you make the save. You take, you take half damage. Yay. Yes. Yes, yes. Man, my damage rolls are kind of doo right now. Good. It's because it knows. Uh, it doesn't want to kill us. Take five, the points, dice five points of fire damage. It's fine. Yeah. Holy are fuck. you bloodied yet, Cass? Yes. <clears throat> like, yeah, okay. It is now Davian's turn. <laughs> I'm going to drink a potion of greater healing. <laughs> <laughs> nice. For... Oh, God. Twelve points of healing. Okay. What's your bonus action? And <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna shoot the one that went after Kess because he's still. I need to make he's a concentration. Hurt, yeah. Oh, true. Hunter's mark. Yeah. How much damage did I take? Twenty. Yes. Does that still mean the DC is ten? Yes. It's 10 or half damage, which is the same in this case. Okay, so. 16. So I'm good. So Hunter's Mark's still up? <clears throat> yep. And I'm going to shoot him. Go for it. Natural 20. Yeah. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's fucking dead. We need, I mean, okay. we need this. Come on. He's, fu he's dead. There's no way he's not dead. Come on. I mean, well, unless you roll minimum damage like Dutch. <laughs> Do not roll minimum damage. It's a Do man not. who just rolled minimum damage. <laughs> That's the face of a man who just rolled minimum damage. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. So... Nine points of piercing damage. One plus one is two. Two plus two is four. Nine points of uh -huh. piercing damage? Mm -hmm. Is that including the hunter's mark damage? I rolled a two and a one. No! Oh. Oh. Not minimum. Oh. Fucking close to it, though. All right, well, uh, he's still standing, but barely. You fucker! <laughs> you absolute fucker! <laughs> hey, man. You're going into no, a fight. You're going into no, fight that no, 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 that okay. was uh, that was. It's not a last room with anyone. I am going well. to move another thirty feet around, just so that I'm not too close to anyone else. Okay. Space Fuck us out. Fuck me, dude. Daigon, you're up. So Guess that you're, one. Uh, you're after this. The one that looks the most hurt, that yes. is not unconscious. How far mm -hmm. is he from me? Because he moved past to do that spell, right? Um. Kess moved ten feet up. And he was 30 feet from Kess. Yeah. So that would mean that he is currently 50 feet away? No. Wait, 20, wait, wait. 20 feet away from Daigon. No. I can make that. 50. I 50. can make that. Oh. Can you make that? Okay, there you go. I can, because I, I didn't move last turn, so my feline agility is regenerated. Because as long as I have zero movement in combat, I can use it again. So I there can make go. it to him okay. without there burning it. So he's 50 feet away from you. Matt's okay, hard. so I go up to his back and just try to jam my spear at his Ooh, back. Okay. Uh, dirty 20. Yeah, that'll hit. Uh, sweet. Roll max damage again, please. Please, please, please. I did! I did! That's a six! So that's nine, nine points of piercing damage in his back. And as you catch up to this guy and you take your spear and you just jam it through his back, <laughs> piercing his heart, pulling the spear out and he just... Crumbles and falls to the floor. All right, and then right. bonus action. I'll use my spectral arms. So like while I'm stabbing him, my spectral arms grab a healing potion and I drink it. Nice. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's my bonus action. All right. Imagine like six arms. Um, be blessed. I heal for. Uh, it could be worse. It's two d four plus two five. I heal for seven hit points. Okay. I mean, hey, it's something. I'm back over twenty. Alrighty. <clears throat> Is that your turn? Yeah, it's my turn. Yes. Okay, I'm going to bonus action and drink a healing potion. <laughs> nice. Thank God. Can't, dude, I can't believe Hawthorne put a motherfucker to sleep. Yeah. Like, uh, Hawthorne <laughs> coming in clutch right now. Coming yeah. in clutch. Wild. Yeah, dude. So, two down. One, he's two more. Bro, I mean, he's imagine, dead, but he's, he's imagine out for now. Imagine sleep spell, Lamau. 
Let's imagine a healer, period. These guys have a lot of fucking health, though. Fuck um, yeah. I've forgotten how many D4 a healing potion is. 2D4 two two D4 plus 2. Plus 2, if yeah. that's a basic. Okay. Yes. Boop. Oh, sick. Uh, 7 healing. Hey, we match. Um, okay, cool. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm going to... Uh... I'm going. How how far away is the guy who hit me? Uh, dead. He's dead now. I got oh, him. Dead? Daigon fucking jammed the, the fucker. spear through his okay. heart through the back. So he's dead. The other guy <laughs> is unconscious still. There are two people. There's left. two wizards yeah. still up and fighting. Yes. I think one of fully healthy though. Uh, one okay. of them is. And one of them hasn't touched yet. Uh, I'm gonna go for the one who hasn't been touched yet. Okay. I'm going to. How far away is he? 80 feet still. 80 feet? Cool. Yeah. I'm gonna Eldritch Blast him. Alright. Um. Oh no, wait. You, uh, you, wait. You. Uh, what's the fucking. Hex. Your hex is yes. still up, but it's on the guy that's unconscious, right? Yeah, I think so. Isn't it technically if a target goes unconscious, you can move your hex? Or is it when they die? Hold on. I believe it's just when they die for hex. I think you I might don't... be able to move hex at will, but I could be wrong. You can't move uh... it at will, I know that for sure. Okay. Let me look it up real quick. Uh, when they drop to zero hit points. Oh, so it's specifically when they when they like okay. Yeah. Gotcha. So he's okay. still hex, but so I was thinking but, yeah. like maybe you could move. Like I'm trying to throw you a bone here because no, you're walking no. into a fight that you no, are. That I think balance I checked for that. six. So I'm trying to Ooh. throw you a bone, but the rule no, said okay. no. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh, uh, twenty. Twenty-three. <laughs> no. Twenty. 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 Twenty-two to hit. That hits. <laughs> Um, Let's go. Let's go, team. We can do it. it is. <laughs> okay. Uh, seven force damage and two thunder. Let's go, team. Okay. I mean, this is the example, though, of the <laughs> dice have a story they want to tell, because the dice yeah. are saving us here with, like, the bad guys just rolling like shit, and we're rolling yeah. okay. It's okay. the fate. Anything fate else? Anything me. else you want to do with your turn? Yes? No. Uh, Hawthorne, on his turn, is going to go invisible and fly 40 feet straight up. Okay. Fair I don't enough. know that's it. All right. Um, the wizards that you just Eldritch blasted. Uh, out of third level spell slots, so no more fireball. Yes! <laughs> more of attrition, baby! Uh, so instead, is going to... What does this do? Let's have a look soon. No! I don't, no, like, the no. I don't like the sound of that. I don't like the sound of that. I don't like the sound of that. No thank you, sir. Um... Ah, he's just gonna chuck a firebolt at, at you, guess. Do it. Just miss. 14 to hit? 14 does not hit. <gasps> oh, Mage Alma Poggers! Alright, so he misses. That's his turn. Um, the wizard that is unconscious is still unconscious. No shit. Um, the other wizard that is still standing is going to... That's the one that Daigon left the melee off of to go after the other guy. I guess Daigon was never in his melee. He was yeah, in, it was he was in hers. Away, right? yeah. He's going to... Make sure that he's 30 feet away from Daigon. And to cast Agonizar Scorcher. Of course. No. Dex save, Winter please. Uh, dirty 20. And you're going to take half damage. Sweet. Ooh. Uh, five yeah. points of fire damage. Okay. Okay. Not I can. I can, I can. I can. My do, damage I rolls are, are like started off pretty strong with like the. the, the Again, it's the universe damage. trying to protect um, us from our shitty choices. That is his turn. Thank you, thank that wizard is dead. Davian, you're up. Using my bonus action to move Hunter's Mark from the unconscious man, oh the dead man, sorry, mm -hmm. <laughs> to um the one the one that got Eldritch blasted. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna shoot him. Uh, for 15 to hit. 15? 
Yeah. Just hits. Natural eight, dude. Like, holy. <laughs> uh, nine points of piercing damage. Okay, okay, okay. And then I'm going to move 10 feet, 20 feet back. Okay. Away. Alrighty. <clears throat> uh, how many times have I fired? Three? <coughs> yes. Three. Keep going. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, keep going to remove arrows. Arrows. Say turn. Uh, yeah, bonus action from Sunset's Mark. Shot moved. Yeah, that's my turn. Uh, Diagon. Okay, so the two that are up, they're now... One of them's 30 feet from me, because he just yeah, used that you. thingy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, okay. My spear, I, I, if I threw it, it'd be a disadvantage of 30 feet. So I'm just going to run up to him, try and stab the spear. Okay. Excellent. I don't like being set on fire. That's 17. It's not nice. 70 to hit? Yeah, hits. 17. It hits. Oh my god! I will take a. I roll the six on the damage dice again. Look Jesus! At it. Look at it. That's a. Oh no! Wait, come on, focus, focus. Oh no! The light. The white square of power. Oh, there I it is! It. I, I see it. the six. We Yay. see it. I see the six. <laughs> For some reason, they feel they need to put the line under the six on a die that only has six oh, sides. I know. Nine. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Anyways, uh, so that's another nine points of piercing damage as I just try and bury Damn. it in right. there. How's he looking after I do that? Uh, Not good. Bloody. <laughs> Are there okay. any like? Doo -doo 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 -sh. Um, we're gonna go for the final burn my last key point then and try while the solid arms have the spear in him, the spectral arms just come in for double oh. punch from either side <laughs> for flurry of blows. Uh, both temples at the same time. Just... <laughs> oh, that wasn't great though. That's only a twelve and a fourteen to hit. Fuck. Oh. No. Uh, oh well, what a waste. The spear was too long, and the arms were like, uh, they couldn't quite reach. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, oh, I under. Well, no, because the arms have a 10 foot reach, the spectral arms. It's more, maybe it's really just, long. I'm just overzealous. I overestimate. I went over his head. I thought he was taller than he was. <laughs> no. All right. Say turn. Yeah, because that was my bonus. And I don't want to lose any some more. Long ass arms. Yeah, only the spectral arms. My physical yeah, arms yeah, yeah. are the limit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. slash Hawthorne. Both okay. of them. Okay. Um, I'm going to attack the same guy I attacked last time. Okay. With Eldritch Blast again. Go for it. Natural 20! Ooh. Whoa! Oh, no! Oh, okay. no! Dude, the music... My okay. music just got so okay. triumphant <laughs> as well. Okay. 12 force damage. And 2 thunder. Hawthorne is just gonna linger up high above. Maybe move another 40 feet away. Okay. And that's it. That's my turn. <clears throat> Man, how much damage did you do? Sorry, did I miss that? I, I did 12 plus 2 thunder. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Okay. Okie dokie. Hmm, this guy that just got Elders blasted. Blasted. <laughs> is gonna just. Ah, oh, actually. Mm -mm. I'm gonna close the gap between himself and Daigon. I'm just gonna assist his homie there. So, Daigon, you're now surrounded by both of the final two guys that are still up. Oh, yeah. yeah. And is going to cast Burning Hands. Of course! Deck save, if you please. Fucking. When you say surround. Bring it. 17. Okay, well, not surrounded. Like, not. Front and back. Homie is not in the burning hands. Burning hands is body yeah. right by. <laughs> that's why I asked. What did you roll? Uh, 17. You make the save, so that's another half damage. Thank God. Um, you're making your saves, which I mean. Most of them are decks, and I'm if, a dexy character. Majority of not all fire so... spells that have saves are decks based, so like you're. And we're the decks. Thanks, we're literally the Dex squad if we just yeah. see Brooks here and then we have all I'm the Dexies. bringing Dexy back. <laughs> yeah! Hey, I'm the Dexiest motherfucker damage. in the group. <laughs> Sorry, is Dutch? Six points of fire damage. Okay. Jax is a trapeze artist, dude. My Dex is 17, <laughs> I, bro. What the fuck? I am looking bloodied now. This guy is still asleep. Dancing. The other guy is going to... I'm looking very scorched. To... 
is going to unsheath a dagger and is just going to try and plant a dagger in your chest. Uh, uh -huh. He's going to be within five feet of you and just... Why? He's lame for trying to stab you or she like in his face punching him. <laughs> uh, 20 Maybe I guess... Yeah. I guess the, the way I made that other save is I just like maybe ducked and just singed like the side rather than direct hit from the burning hands. I need you to make a constitution saving throw, by the way, please. Oh, oh no, it's I poison. don't win those. Uh, I, these I don't win, You take dude. two points of piercing damage just from the dagger, like, piercing. Okay. Um, I rolled a 16 for Ooh. my cod save. Ooh. Natural you 15 plus not one. not affected by any poison. Fuck, thank God. All right. Uh, back to Davian. My God, the rolls are with me. Do you I think the guy who sends his marks is pretty fucked up right now. <laughs> I think <laughs> that's the guy that Kess. Uh, one of them is bloodied. The one that that, that, that um, Kess has been. Like, I think the Hunter's marks one is the one that Kess has been fucked up. <laughs> yes, you and Kess have been hitting the same guy. That <laughs> uh, no, no. I specified <laughs> the one that Kess Eldritch blasted. I moved my Hunter's mark to and shot, but that was. Oh right, yeah, you're, you're right, you're right, you're right. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, so that's seventeen to hit. Uh, with my bow. Hits. You are right. Oh, big numbers for once. We love to see it. 16 points of piercing damage. There you go. Ooh, okay. No, no, no. I was wrong. I thought it was an, I thought it was an eight. It's a three. Oh. Aww. 11. 11 points Aww. of piercing damage. Okay. It really looked like an eight. Okay. 11 points. And then bonus action. Down comes Onu. Burb. Down comes Onu. <laughs> And he misses. Why does that sound like a kid's show? <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking misses, dude. Natural two. Oh, Natural oh, two? Yeah. Yikes. Oh, oh, no. No. It's, oh, it's, the, it's, oh, the, it's like the, the canopy of the forest and stuff. He's having a hard time. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the bird you Dagen. summoned in the jungle. You're up. Oh, yeah, but the, the, he like fishes at swamps and stuff where it's open. I guess you know? we'll do. I'll Rivers go again. And... The one I stabbed with the spear again and go again and then spectral arms to bonus action to single hit and try and punch the guy behind me. There's one in front, one in back. Okay. So the what, spear hit. Oh, natural twenty. Oh, yes. thank God. Dude, which one are you spearing? That'll... Just be exact. The one, the one that was in front of me that I already speared the first okay. time. Okay, 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 okay. I believe he's in front of me. Okay, please roll a six again. Now I have the crit. This is when I roll the one, because I have the crit. Nope, it's a five. I'll take okay. that. You take that. So that's plus what? Hold on, what's the multiplier? Wait, that 10 is an plus, eight. 10 plus three, 13 points of piercing damage. 13? The spear. Yeah. And then the bonus action. Can't really tell. Um, unarmed strike oh, to I the guy see. behind me. That's a three. It's so close. Oh, that's not great. That's a 15. Just hits. Oh, thank God. He takes seven points of force damage because it's Ooh. with the spectral arms. Okay, okay. Very nice. Is that your turn? Yeah, I was really hoping one of them was going to die there. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I'm, I'm going I'm going down this turn, guys. <laughs> this is what's happening. Okay. Nah, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm going to attack the same guy with Eldritch Blast. Wait. Does Daikon wear armor? No. Because monks, you can't wear armor if you want. Uh, once you level up, so you could you mage armor Diagon. I could, but she's already Eldritch blasted, and I'm Just... already mage armed. Yeah, but you can have two up at once, right? It's not concentration. Um, no, but when I think when you use it again, I'm it pretty sure mage armor is only one. self, right? No, it's not. It's no, how oh, is it? It's, it's touched. Yeah, she doesn't have to run up to me, and there's baddies. Yeah, Touch yeah. Touch a creature. Uh... It doesn't well, specify you can't they use don't two. armor, or you dismiss it. Hmm. It doesn't say. It just says that it stays up it for eight hours. It could be cast uh, yeah, on several, oh, several sure. creatures. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think if in my... you had lots of spell slots. Mm, yeah, yeah, no, it was just a thought. What, me? No, just in general. Like... Oh, in general? Because um, it's not a spell slot. Interesting. Oh. Doesn't say. Anyway. Oh, um... oh for your invocation? Yeah, um, Chad, you can I'm, only I'm cast not sure on the yourself. invocation one is. You, you can only I... cast it on yourself at will. True, that's fair. There you go. Cool. Uh, seventeen to hit. Hits. Nice. Uh, ten. Ha <laughs> ha. Ten points of ten damage. Ten of force damage and two of thunder. And this guy also falls. Yes. yes! One, one left, baby. One left. 
The one behind, behind the one me. you punched. Okay, that's behind me, yeah. Yeah. How far away is he from me? I like 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 thirty feet. Okay. I'm no I'm not I'm not I'm I'm good. I'm good. Okay. Hawthorne doing anything? Nope. Alright. I don't want him to He die. did his work. He did his work. Uh, he contributed. This guy <laughs> sees his uh fellow fall and is going to look around um, and look up to the sky and see <laughs> hold on hold on hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> poor boy give me a second I gotta quickly find something Rose has read it A running guys, am I right? <laughs> all right, I'll catch up to you. You're I'm just getting it. your cardio in for the day. Yeah, there oh, you go. Oh, cardio. Yeah, this man's just okay. And that's just like, <gasps> give me. Okay. Looks is just like drinking out of his third he flask looks up now. And is going to cast Skyrite. Oh. What? Yep. Oh. And in yep. the sky, in the clouds, he writes. Oh. Lord Fearkrog, mission complete. Oh, no. That's his turn. Do we see him? The writing in the sky? Yeah. You yeah. Can look I guess we're a bit like distracted. Through like a, a gap in the canopy. In the sky. You write it in common. Yeah. Okay. Lord Fearkrog. Because of the the Fear rush. Krog. Because of the rush and the the like the the haste behind it. His can you first, spell his, Fear his primary Krog? language is, is common, and that's how he writes it. He didn't have, didn't want to like you know think about oh draconic. He's just yes, like, man, can you final moments? Can you spell Fear Krog for me, I please? It, I have it written down somewhere. Okay, thanks. F I E R. Uh, wait, um, F -I -E excuse me. F I E R K R W A G. Thank you. Just, anyone else hear Koiba just in the background? What? Hello? I have it written somewhere. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah. The, yeah, quote yeah. in our session zero, we dealt yeah, with these cultists. Yeah, 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 okay. Okay. Not giving a Lazarin any matches anytime soon. <sighs> All right, and that's his turn. Davian. Look for this. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> I'm just going to start with my bonus action commanding over so that we can. Huh? Actually, yeah, fuck it, yeah. Bonus action. Oh, no. Suspense. And he misses, so that's great. <laughs> this guy don't have Hunter's March, right? Correct. And I missed as well. Very nice. Oh no. So I'll just use my movement to start running towards him 30 feet from about 100 feet away. Okay. And, uh. God, I'm gonna kick the shit out of Onu after this fight. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> we go go to bed. We just hear like <laughs> fucking idiot. <laughs> All right, is that Peter, the twentieth yeah, level yeah, yeah, druid yeah. that terrifies people? Oh, oh god. Dagon, you're up. <coughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay, last one. Um, I'm just gonna do because it's the one that was behind me. I want to do a cool like pull of spear. That was partially out of guy and do a really cool like spin around and slash him while I spin around. Monk shit. Please oh, yeah. hit. That'd be embarrassing. Seventeen. Um, it's I was gonna say my favorite thing that Laura does is describe <laughs> a really cool move. Miss. It's really cool. <laughs> describes it perfectly. Then misses it. It's like yeah, it's, it's, the, it's the classic <laughs> of uh, like Marisha, where she's like, yeah. uh, can I like run, jump, kick off the wall and do a flip <laughs> and <laughs> roll an acrobatics check? Five. <laughs> yeah. <you're> okay. <laughs> All right, and then that's you just another <laughs> punching things and just winning. another six, so nine points of piercing damage. Or yeah, as I come around and just did a diagonal arc spin. And with that, you yeah. cut him down. Yes. The only one that Max remains. Can the I only then one bonus? That, uh, remains is the one fast asleep okay. in, or well, like not asleep I... but unconscious. I immediately I'm... run over to him and start tying him up with rope before he wakes nice. up. Nice. Okay. <laughs> uh, with that, oh, it'll I be mean... a few minutes before your allies arrive. What do you do? Um... I mean, collect as many arrows as I can, which I think attacks that how I actually many, landed. How many turns of combat was that? Sorry? 
How many turns of combat was it? Like four? Five, five or six? Five, yeah, five, like four, five, like I think. Five. 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 I will be there <laughs> in two minutes and 32 seconds. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> okay. Before I'm tying I... this guy up to mm -hmm. fuck. Like, I'm double checking my knots. I'm just, I make sure the hands are of a particularly bound. Walk. Okay, okay, calm down. That's not what I meant. <laughs> so he can't even, like, do, like, this, like, middle, like, like his whole entire hands will be pinned to sides by rope. I'm um, going to check on the horses before I go collecting arrows. The horses are fucking yeah. panicking. I'm oh, going to do, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do my best to calm them down and tend to their wounds. I will use fucking potions if I have to. I will. Uh, but out. just like, <laughs> I want to help. Looking like... around for like herbs to soothe the burns or whatever. Like make, just uh, make an animal handling check. How far did horses run? They did it. Kaz uh, is helping me. Do I get? Yeah. Anything from that? Sure. Advantage. Advantage? Yeah. <clears throat> oh, 23. You managed to, ca to calm the horses down, but they are in pain. Mm. They're like, the, you know, patches of their skin, like, show oh. already, like, is already, already blistering. I will use my and daily speak with animals. Mm -hmm. And just reassure them that, uh, Elazarin and Jax will be here soon and hopefully we'll be able to help them. And uh, I will oh. take out my water skins too and I will try and like, you know, flush the wounds and like cool them down with with water. It's, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Someone, they're coming soon. They'll be able to help you a lot better than I can. But just you're very brave, very brave, very good horses. Uh, every everything's gonna be fine. I'm just like, <laughs> <laughs> well, I just like gently stroke. Like the oh, horses, they look, like they, they look, uh, they look very rough. Like the, their skin in, in parts is like blistering already. Some oh, of their like, no. very, like there's like patches of their guys. Like, we got hit with fire too. Okay, fur. like I know the whole, like poor horses. <laughs> what you also like, 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 like part, patches of of their, of their like their like fur, I guess, uh, and skin. So kind the of, outside. Mm -hmm molten together it, like they're that's not looking great the outside yeah. has been seared perfectly and now we just need to oven bake them to cook no! them like, oh, oh my god much. those horses are still so even here yourself. is kind of insane yeah, yeah. that explosion I guess, goes off and their horses they panic good. and run away and they don't oh, i know that's what i'm saying like Yay. i would have ran yes and I while they're doing that i'm just guarding the been. unconscious man in case he wakes up and i left a tiny like tail of the rope out for something someone to like that we can hold so we can like okay. you know drag right. him or like uh, yeah I'm drag him along a, like a like couple of minutes like, what are you, minute yeah. is he gonna wake up at all because only one minute he was unconscious that means you'll have like a, a little under under a minute before he uh, will wake up i okay. i'm gonna sign to dive in to gag him Okay, uh, let me look at my inventory. And I'm gonna throw her shirt from... Oh, my okay, well, then there we go. So I'll do that and gag him as well, yeah, so, so you he pull, can't... You pull the back a little anything. bit so you can, like, see his face, and you just fucking stuff his mouth with, uh... Is it a with, uh, human? That, this individual that this last is guy? a red dragonborn. Okay, okay. While Speak with Animals is active, because it left for ten minutes, mm -hmm. I will stay with the horses, and I will also bring... Onu down, and I'll just be like, what the fuck was that? What do you mean? What, was someone giving you trouble? Like, you seem to be having a hard time. <laughs> what? I'm sorry. No, I'm just, I'm asking, I'm just, if there's something, some, you know, I, were you flying a bit too high? Like, do I need to talk? Uh, I guess I, um, I didn't, I, I'll do. I'll do better. That's, all right. Listen, listen. That's all I need to hear. All right. That that was that was close. Okay. That was close. And uh, I don't know what happens to you if I die. So. Me neither. Oh my god. And I'll uh, throw him a bit of dry meat from my rations, and then sort of carry on with the horses. Okay. I'm gonna call Hawthorne back. Huh? Um. Are you, are you good, okay? Man? You see that? You that was drunk. incredible. <laughs> that was amazing. Are you are you okay? That's the first time that ever happened. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Never seen it do that before. Oh, amazing. <laughs> 
Are you are you okay? You 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 got quite hurt. Yeah, I'm alright. Um, why don't you go in the battle and and rest? I um, I mean, I, we're good now, right? Yeah, yeah, that's no. true. Okay. At this point, uh, the uh, gagged individual will wake up. He's like, mm -hmm. tied up and everything. I'm just full glaring. It's probably even creepier than my normal resting, wrinkly, scarred bitch face because half of my face is all bubbly and blistering from burning hands. I look gross right now. Uh, um, I'm gonna go and kneel like in front of uh, in front of him while huh? we wait for everyone else. Um, Have I made it to the house yet? Like, are we? I was gonna get to that in a second. Just okay. for the sake well, of he's like a minute ahead of us. For the sake of storytelling, I kind of, you know what I mean? Like, this is oh, rough. Yeah. Um, um, your friends are dead. We're taking you to Eldalon. <laughs> and you will be gagged the entire time. <gasps> so, stay comfy. Question, question to DM. You huh? said it's a red dragonborn. Does Correct. he look like the red dragonborn who we stole the crown from? No. Okay, I was gonna be like, You're oh shit, oh shit, it's not him. No. <clears throat> Different red dragonborn. Uh, okay, we'll say for the purpose of this. At this point, the other guys will have made it to the house that is still, like, burning. The fire is growing and growing still. What do you, what do you guys do? House. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna start just fucking, like last time, I'm gonna take off my, um... What's your like, passive perception? To... My passive perception mm -hmm. is 14. That is also 14. You'll hear... Yeah, the second the second I hear help, I like I take off my like main tablet like I did last time, roll up my fucking sleeves, put it like fold up like kind of gently, put a thing about right whoa, 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 here whoa. before. I'm summoning it's my armor. Are you? Are you, are you it's a yeah, what to... are we tap this person out? Are you? Are you getting ready to go in? Of course. I met, might be done before. I'm kicking the no, door no, down. No, no, no. I mean, I'll leave him to kick the door. Uh, make a strength check. Uh, okay. So go. Find a trough, get some water. I, I might I be the best thing. choice for this last run. Well, fine then. I'll find some water. Bloody well, get in there. Uh, nope, I don't. Okay. Okay. Well, get ready to dive for you. Siren looks up. You, you see that? Pointing what? at the sky riding in the clouds. Oh, bugger. <laughs> <laughs> uh, flat 17. that mean anything to any of you? Yes, but currently... No. Deal with this in a second. Already later. like shirtless at this point. And okay, you're all seventeen. So burning, burning, burning. Yes. Old man Jacks fucking <laughs> kicks that door in, dude. Door Fuck oh, yeah. Flies off the hinges. I'm looking for a trough and maybe like a bucket. Um, yeah, there is uh, a nearby like pen where you can see some cows. Uh, that is, has, has like a big trough of water nearby and everything. Any any bucket of water or like? Uh, yeah, there's it? some buckets like, like kind of like stacked, like okay, buckets next to it. Fill up bucket, right. and just go on bucket runs and just fucking okay. try and start. What do I see inside? Uh, you're met by just a bunch of flames that are kind of like have have reached the inside. Some of the walls are in the process of burning down, and you hear like a muffled help, help me, coming from upstairs. <coughs> I'll put my hand on. All right, I guess I'm going just upstairs. So I'm, I'm right there with you. As you go upstairs, you kind of have to, like, uh, the upstairs, like, the roof, it's a thatched roof, and that caught fire really quickly. Part of it has, has collapsed. Uh, and you hear from behind another door, just, like, muffled, help! I guess I'm kicking this one down, too. Or, does it open? <clears throat> uh, you can try. Open the door? Yeah, I'll just try to open the door. It does yeah. open. It is not locked. Okay, yeah. <laughs> and as you inside, easier. you can see oh. a young boy, roughly, pff, eight or nine years old, currently, like, being squished, held down by, like, a heavy beam that is on fire. Help! Oh. Uh, it's camping too special, will, Johnny! I will go and lift the beam. Make a strength check. I don't care if it's on fire, I'll pick it up. His name? It's burning. Johnny. John. <laughs> John. Uh, John. That's John. The Jonathan. Check. Um, G. A strength check. Jonathan right. Johnson. Uh, it's... Uh, Fucking 15 is not great for me. 15? Yeah. Uh, you do take... Um, three points of fire damage as you kind of like ignore the fact that the beam is on fire and you kind of let, let, let it burn your hands. But you do manage yeah. to lift the beam up and push it off of the, the, the boy. Um, 
he then he then looks at you and and like gets up. Get me out of here, please. I'm, uh... <coughs> and like you see his face is covered in soot. Like he's he's inhaled a lot of smoke. He's not doing too well. I'll scoop him up and run out. I guess. Okay. Are so there any other doors back upstairs? Down this, back down the stairs. I mean, yeah. There's another another handful of rooms upstairs. Okay. Uh, do you uh, just go back Jack's downstairs? Out. Yeah, I just go back downstairs. Okay, and you you make your way back to the front to the front door. Uh, this 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 uh, this boy kind of like falls to his knees, uh, and, and and looks at all looks at all of you, coughing his his fucking lungs out. Ugh, thank you. I um, I am. Um, uh, what? And he just pff, passes out. Oh. I'm gonna start checking the other rooms. Um. Uh, sure, I guess. Uh, I'm still trying to contain the fire, just like where I can, at least in the bottom floor. Okay. Okay. Um, you're going like if you're going room for room, you don't see any other people. Uh, there's another bedroom upstairs, uh, which seems to be like probably the bedroom where the, the kids' parents probably sleep in. Um, a couple of supply rooms. There's no, there's no other people. There's no, no other like, people. No. There's no crispy corpses either. Where is his parents? Correct. Cool. I I will when he's there. When as he's gone unconscious, as he's gone yeah. unconscious, I will just kind of put my hand gently on like his head and just do a, a cure wounds on him. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I'm still able to just go down the stairs and leave. Kill him for twelve. Kill him for max. Okay. Then I'll just walk Damn. out. Damn. All right. There you go. Thanks. And then go back to just like trying to fucking just. Yeah. Down uh, it's it's yeah. getting to a point where. It's, it's um, gone. The fire is spreading very faster than you yeah. are able to really put it out. The thatch roof has completely caught fire, and that is just setting fire to the entire rest of the building. I will find if it looks like there's any on the on the bottom floor where like there's lesser fire. If there's just anything that looks not like viable, looks like maybe like an heirloom, or if there's anything that's like well, make an investigation check. He's casing the joint while like an antique, maybe. Yeah, I'm looking for stuff that like can be saved at this point. That like it's sentimental. Excuse Stuff that he can take as a reward for saving the child. Exactly. Stuff that he can pawn. A fair trade. Eight. Your child's real life ring. Eight. Eight. Eight? Uh, I mean, there's one really, like, obvious... Uh, like, like, trinket in, in, like, the living room. Mounted Gosh. above the fireplace. Mm. There is a big, um, like, painting that seems to have not been touched by the fire yet. I will take that fucking painting off and just run out. Okay. So if it breaks it, the painting is go. of uh, of the the like uh, presumably the small the, the small boy, uh, accompanied by two by two women kind of standing behind them. Seems to be it's like a family portrait, maybe. Nice. Okay. Right, I will. Yeah, I'll just like fucking. <laughs> like jiggle up the nail. Fuck. <laughs> it's getting off and it's just like up on my fuck 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 <laughs> Try not to let it get on fire. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna play it down. That troop just falls <laughs> on you. <laughs> fuck it. I trip over his face through it. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. With that, yeah, you, no. you've, you've spent some minutes. Uh, the boy is still like passed out. He uh... Does it look like he's like killed quite a bit? Yeah, yeah, he looks he looks better. He's I think uh, you, you reckon that him passing out is just from the sheer like yeah. panic, panic, and like the the, mm -hmm. the adrenaline and everything is getting too much, and his like he's just. Um, I want to investigate around the house for potential parents. If there's like any outbuildings or um, any graves. <laughs> yeah, just any bodies laying in the ground. Make a perception check. Yeah. We're all potential parents. Uh, nine. Potential graves. Nine? Nine. Not as well as you can see. Okay. So that's good and bad. Um. Elazarin, did you see where the others went? Um, did I see roughly where the others went? Yeah. At all? Did we see? Like, yeah. you know the direction. Um, Plus, like, the know the in the sky seems they, to be a good indicator. Yeah, they're probably on the way back now, right? Or are they waiting? I don't know. Are they? I don't know. We can just wait for us if they're going there. Well, we a, I think we're waiting because well, the horses are hurt. The horses are sparked. Everything's on fire. Why don't we wait, like, don't we wait in the house, kind of guys? At, Siren kind of looks at you yeah. all. How about two of us stay with the boy and the rest of us go see what that message in the sky if is all about? If there's, if there's Stop fighting again. 
If those others got to where I think they did, and if they found people, they might need healing. I'll go over and help them. This boy, I've helped him as much as I can. If you think it's that bad, then do you want me to come with you just in case? I have no idea about this, but the writing in the sky isn't exactly fantastic news. Alright, I guess me and Siren will stay here. Siren non. I have a, I have a question, bad. DM. Hello. If I gave say half of a regular healing potion to each horse could it heal 1d4 plus one and that's not how consumables work okay that's just just, okay. just, oh, just figured it would be worth a try yeah no no yeah, yeah. It's, it's nice try so yeah it's a nice try but like that's just not how, not how consumables yeah. work in games <clears throat> i will um don't get up to how they weren't like too too far away were they uh like a couple minutes like towards like you see you see a tree line um like pretty much directly under the riding in the sky, like like a couple minutes still of walking. Kind of but... be, I'll be calling out like, "Hello, you guys." Yeah, I, would be, I, I think the ho me and the horses would be at the edge of the tree line anyway, and I would see Elazar sort of making his way from the from the houses. Well, and, and I figured would we just start walking way... back towards the house once the guy woke up and Kess did her like, "Your friends are dead, you're fucked, let's go." And then we're just taking him. So you'd see us like walking back. We kind of meet in the middle, maybe, or maybe not the middle, but closer. To I don't know. I don't know. Well, I would ask the horses. Do you do you think you can walk even slowly towards the others? I oh, could try. And the horse is kind of. Right. Just do your best. Unlike someone. I'm <laughs> kidding. I'm kidding. I'm not. I'm not going to bully Onu. <laughs> <laughs> Just Imagine do your best, and I'll further. sort of take the reins and sort of start walking across the field. Literally creating a villain. <laughs> <laughs> How are you guys okay? Oh. Well. We're, we're fine. I mean, he can shut up. Um, but the horses, the horses are really badly hurt. I don't. How are you, you guys doing? I'll kind of look over them both. Like, I look not I great. Look. I look very I look. blistery and like kind of wobbly <laughs> well, on my feet, but I'm not asking for healing. Well, at least there. <laughs> I look okay. okay. We've they've known last anyways. We've managed to save a child from the farmhouse. Um, any any signs of any parents or anything? No. No, nothing oh. that I can see at least. I can't look at Brooks and any fuse or anything. I was trying to dazzle fires. I I know this might seem like a waste of uh, magic, but I don't think the horses will get us anywhere close to Eldalon in this shape. That's fine. Yeah, we I can... point to the horses, implying heal them. I can do something. Who, Whoever's injured, sit near me for a little bit. And I'll start to cast Prayer of Healing. Ooh. Oh! On everyone. Oh, and beautiful. Oh. I can get six creatures, so it's I got one spare. I'll just fucking not do Beautiful. it. Make sure you don't heal the baddie. I, 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 I will drag I that guy just out of the radius. <laughs> oh, well, well, just stand just if, like we, pass well over. if we, <laughs> because I was gonna say if we make the other like two minute walk back to the house, you could heal the kid as well. I've already healed the kid. I fucking oh okay. Yeah, I, he, I, he I, I, healed, I, I the kid He's... is in a stable condition. He's as healed as I can get him. It's so just fucked up. It will take this will take a few minutes though to do. It is a full uh, Nah, we have time. Ritual right, so if you don't mind waiting around for a little bit. Mm -hmm. so says, I just kind of like ungracefully lie down on the floor <laughs> and just like starfish and I'm just like uh. just, you, you know, <laughs> stroke peppers, mane. I'll spend the next ten minutes. I'll, I I'm okay. like petting caramel. Yeah, <laughs> I was gonna say ten minutes. Casting mm -hmm. prayer Everyone heals for twelve points. Yeah. Horses are full Yay. again. Yay! I'm full again. I'm full again. I'm, Woo. <laughs> Let's I'm looking good. I I I'm full again. I guess I no, because I'm staying out the range because I'm dealing with the dickhead. Yep. I say I'll, now. I'll say, I'll just punch him inside the head. <laughs> now instead of like the like blistery, bubbly looking burns, I just have burns that look like they like after they've healed for a few days. There's still some kind of sensitive, like pinkish skin. But it's not gross looking anymore. I think. I, I mean, by this point, speak with animals will have run out completely. Yeah. So how would you just like, jump cut for the ten minutes? Like, boom, it's happened. Or mm. I will say, but after the ten minutes, do you guys uh, like kind of like reconvene well, oh, at the house? Or... Oh, oh, yeah, wait. I'm, I I just I don't say anything. Well, obviously, but I I <laughs> kind of have a like uh you see eyes widen for a minute. Like, oh, idea, and I just book it back to the clearing to go through the pockets of the dead people. Make an investigation check. I don't normally do well at these. I um, think she's finally leaving us. That's a nine. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nine? 
Mm -hmm. Nine? Uh, you, oh, motherfucker. I'm, I, I say, I, I'm doing it really quickly because I don't want to keep the party waiting, so I'm probably going to miss a lot. Because uh, I, I want to do a quick, quick check. Potion. Filled with okay, an, just orange, a basic. Oh. an orange, an orange like, fizzing liquid. Ooh, okay. Lucid? Yes. <laughs> do any of them have, like, a bag of marshmallows? <clears throat> no. <laughs> I can't imagine there's like much more maybe. offensive than like burning down a house and then just fucking <laughs> over them. Holy fuck there's people are screaming in the background. <laughs> uh, I bet a charred body yeah. is pretty good for so, embers. So um, you find that like an oil like a potion with an oil liquid. Um, yep. And as you all kind of reconvene in front of the farmhouse where where Jackson, Siren, still are like are with the kid, the kid slowly like wakes up, and uh, we'll go on our break there. Yay. We'll pick this up after uh, our little 10 to 15 minute break, typically. Woo! Thanks for being here. Uh, Shadow, thanks for the 10 gifted dude. And James, thanks for the prime, you legend. Um, legend! Legend! We'll be here That's again legend, in uh, 10, maybe 15 minutes, depending on you know how fast everybody no, returns. Fucking survive, dude. Um, that was interesting. Because you guys went balls deep into a fight that was meant for like all six plus Siren of you. And we You're lived! so lucky. You're so See, lucky. You're so lucky. You yeah. guys should have died. To, you guys yeah. should have died. Due to some souls, shit rolls on sure. my side uh, and me deciding to, that they wouldn't all cast Fireball. For instance. Yeah. Like, yeah. I mean, that was. I well, easily, probably because I they, they... could have thrown three Fireballs at you, but I decided to not. Yeah. You're welcome. But they also probably went into it cocky, like, oh, there's four of us and three of them. So it makes sense they were holding back for a second. And then when they realized, oh, fuck, it's a bit late. So that's yeah. maybe why. That and it we can't roll dude, in max it, damage. That Hawthorne stuff. roll saved us. That too. One guy without real quick. Is yeah, MVP. it's Hawthorne. Like, yeah. <laughs> Out of character, Hawthorne's the only one of that group that I and like. And if there was right the now. least value. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we'll be right back, guys. <laughs> it would be down to
Okay. Hello there. General Hello. 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 All right. We are back to uh, the second half of our session today. You all gather in front of the house that is just slowly, slowly kind of burning down. Um, the uh, young lad kind of woken up and, and as sees the rest of your group approaching, dragging a gagged and tied up man <clears throat> with you. And he kind of like instinctively seeks to co seeks cover behind Jax because Jax is like broad and tall. Hello, uh, li uh, young man. Hello. And I'll take, sort of take, kneel down and like put, you know, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> What's your name then? Timothy. Do you know, do you know where your parents are, yeah, Timothy? They're... A farm down the road. They they went to go visit some of our neighbors and, and trade some supplies and whatnot. They they. But that's you know that's about half an hour walk down th that way. And he kind of like points in that general direction, like to, to he point southwest. He, yeah, he points towards Eldilon. Yeah, like like the, you can see kind of there's some more farmhouses between where you are mm -hmm. now and Eldilon, and that's where he's pointing. No at. doubt they'll probably spot the flames sooner rather than later. But we can take you. Down the road to your parents. Why? Uh, how fucked up are the horses still? Uh, Not at all. They're fully, fully healed. They're they're full? Okay. Yeah. Besides, like you know, it's maybe some <laughs> traumatized, but other than that, they're really good. <laughs> Physically, they're fine. Mentally, you know, mentally, who's the same. Would you like some water, Timothy? He just kind of nods. I will. I will go forward and give him my water skin. Like, crouch in front of him. Thank you. And he just... I'm staying like away and trying to kind of like almost obscure myself behind other party members because I have scared children in the past. <laughs> my appearance, and I'm trying not to do that. I'm I'm Davian. And uh these Hello? these are my friends. I mean no doubt they helped you. They did. They saved me. And uh you're very brave to have made it through all that, Timothy. Um Obviously, I hope I hope you uh, don't mind this here. And I'll is the is the guy who's tied up? Is he like on his feet? No, I carried him and threw him on the ground. Oh, I really want to kick him. <laughs> kick him? He's on the ground. He takes one point of bludgeoning damage. <laughs> True neutral things. This here, and I'll give the guy like a sharp kick in the ribs. Is uh, one of the men who did this to your home, and uh, we'll make sure that. Justice comes to him and all his kind. Okay. The, we have a cart about. I don't know. Five, it's about a five minute four walk. Four minutes run, or probably about an eight minute walk. Right, an eight minute walk away from here. We, we've got to take the horses, and we can just we'll 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 go up the road and uh, get you home. Well, get you to your parents. Sorry, your home's here, well, obviously. I but... appreciate that. You might have to stay, you know, with your neighbors or something for a while, because obviously probably can't come back here anytime soon. That's fine, though. I could probably land him a tent. <laughs> <laughs> Having one for would you would you prefer to walk with us to the carriage or the I, cart? I don't want to be alone. Okay. We could always. We could. I could we stay could... here with you. I'm no, we, we 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 should we should we should I take him. With we you. should take him. That's what I mean. Okay. I will go to the painting that I put down, pick that up. <laughs> it's like a family portrait. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's like him and like two women. Didn't him you and say? two women. Yeah. Hmm. At least you know who to look out for. Yeah, I mean, hopefully so, and it's not like you know, older sisters or something. No, how how old are you, Timothy? Those are my mums. Oh, I'm old. nine. Well, if you know, I was going to say you could hold Kess's hand or something, but I'm sure you've, you're 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 past that. I'm sure, okay. unless you really want to. Okay. Um, I mean, right. I have a friend who can stay really close anyway and protect you, and I'll like just a fourth hawthorn. Uh, I think you're going to say Ooh. die. That's probably scary as fuck. 
What's that? This is my friend, Thorn. I'm Thorn. Nice to meet you. Oh, God. How's it going, good? Yeah. I'm the drunk uncle. <laughs> How's your ma? Which one? <laughs> the hot one. Oh, for you, um... I guess I'll start walking at this point. Mm -hmm. I'll just be kind of leading one of the horses. Um, do you, like, you like birds, Timothy? Oh, like animals, yeah. Like any animal, really. Horses, birds, I don't know, dogs, cats. Oh, uh, like... Wait, did that... I can't fucking... I can't whistle, whatever. <laughs> I just, like, gesture for Oni to fly down. And he's just like... Oh, he's <laughs> massive! Yeah, he's about, well, he's probably about as tall as Timothy, to be honest. Oh, he's taller, what taller probably. What kind of bird is that? Uh, this is a, a shoe-billed stork. They're native to this... To this con Well, you grew up here, so I, mean, I suppose it's nothing out of the ordinary, but... Well, um, um, I've seen big birds, but never from this close. That's fair enough. Ooh. Yeah, well, that's true. But uh, he's he's a very he's a very good boy, is Onu, and uh, why are you yelling faithful. at him? Like you can't understand <laughs> shoe bill, so you have no idea what I was saying. Okay, this is true. Thank you very much. You I could have been singing his praises. Never mind. <laughs> read body language. Can though. I? I'm putting that on yeah, my I can read body language. Oh, yeah, like a male, like. <laughs> <laughs> can I pet him? Does he does he like being pet? Oh, he, he loves being pet. Yeah, absolutely. I pet him all the Ruffle his feathers. And then there's um him, uh, when when birds grow new feathers, they they come out in a, like a small sort of uh uh a little, like a little sheath, and you can sort of crumble them between your fingertips as the you know, the young feathers that are inside it sort of grow out. And he loves that, especially the ones on his neck. He can't really reach for himself unless he scratches with his feet. So if you just get under his feathers, you'll feel like little um almost like spines, and you just Give them a little twist and they'll crumble between your fingertips. Onu kind of looks at you and like lowers his head so that uh, Timothy Aww. can reach and Timothy kind of does that. And... Oh, yeah, my brother has a pet parrot. They fucking love that shit. It's like <laughs> drugs to them. They, they, when the new feathers grow, yeah, they're in these little white like sheets and you can just boop, boop, boop and they crumble apart and there's new feathers. <laughs> and yeah, they, they fucking love it. Also, birds smell really good. I don't know. <laughs> okay. What the fuck? Yeah. There you go. Um, you make it to the cart. Uh, it hits the horses again, and the horses seem to have kind of like, re like, grabbed whatever like semblance of somewhat being okay. Like, pull themselves together a little <laughs> bit, like mm. enough to at least like carry on business as usual. I'm fine. I'm I'll, fine. I'll take some feed okay. and like you know feed them from my hands and like you know, <laughs> sort of stroke them and try and. Just kind of get them a little more relaxed, mm -hmm. feel them all themselves as I hitch them up to the uh, to the cart again. I reckon the horses oh. would prefer cider than whiskey. <laughs> Honestly, I don't, yeah, I don't think they'd turn down whiskey right now. I want to look for like a limb, like about six to seven feet long, that I could like whittle down. Oh, like a tree limb? Yeah, yeah like yeah, a I tree thought you meant a, a living <laughs> <horse> <laughs> like a limb. Limb. <laughs> I was like, whoa! Uh, I mean, yeah, Look, sure, uh, there's, there's, yeah, there's, there's, yeah. Fuck it, okay, sure. Cool. Cool. Uh, as I sort of get up onto the front of the cart again, I'm sort of ready to drive the, the horses towards the other farmstead. Um, that was probably, I know you didn't really see what happened in the forest, but, um... No. Not you, Timothy. Oh. Um, uh, <laughs> But that was probably a mistake. And we were very, very lucky. Well, 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 all's well that ends well. So you're here and you're alive. Yeah. As, he's, cool. as he says this, and then Timothy also saying, No, I realize, oh, and I just kind of tried and chilly, like, just like take my spear and wipe some blood and some <laughs> sticky bits <laughs> off of it because it killed it. Killed There's two just people. like a few <laughs> bits of brain <laughs> yeah. on it. <laughs> Some guy's like, like of heart from that one guy that you fucking half stuck. of one yeah. guy's lung just stuck on the side. Say, yeah. It's just started to stop so of beating. <laughs> oh my god. So I just kind of like trying to wipe it off and, like with like a rag that I keep for that. I'm just and, like, like pack. and my fucking shit will come rub it off for you. <laughs> oh, shit. and then I, I just oh nod at Jack. Uh -oh. <laughs> just click and you can clean that up like... as well. 
<laughs> Did you drop a towel? <laughs> what just happened? Why are you on it? Nothing happened. What happened? No. What did you do? I spilled my plate, motherfucker. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's called in her own is that? In her own is that? If he plays through the entire session in wet pants, does he get DM inspiration? <laughs> That's just gone. That's just Why is this so funny? That was just funny because Dutch is done. It's just timed very well. That's what it is. I'm gonna be taking a short commercial break here. It wasn't just like the. I'm okay. I'm okay. It wasn't. It wasn't. You were like, I spilled. You were like, I dropped the motherfucker. Like you were just so mad. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Well, uh, should we head back to the cart? I thought we were in the cart. We're hitch up in the cart. We're already walking in the cart. In the cart. Fuck. We're in the car now. In the car now. We're all in the car. Okay then. <coughs> Last I'll one. Hello there. I have a question for you that's totally off topic of everything that's just happened. That sounds like a fantastic anything to keep us going in this ten minutes. I got some. Stuff. I got some weird new coins that I don't recognize, and I wondered if you could tell me what I need to know about them. Okay. I will pull out a platinum. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I well. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how much this is worth. That is worth around what? 10 gold. And by around, I mean exactly 10 gold. Because that's how okay. current Okay. <laughs> and what, what, what could I buy with it? You know what I mean, you could you buy, buy... 10 gold. Okay, you know you get what one you gold, I'll pull out a really shiny resist. big gold. You know what you could buy with one of these, right? Mm-hmm. Now imagine what you could buy, and I'll pull out te oh, 10 <laughs> of these. <laughs> See, what you could buy with See? this amount, you could buy with this amount. You can buy so much, so much for various different kinds of gold. I'm yeah. very confused. I don't understand the way yeah. currency works. I, well, in actually, sign platinum. language, will just say it's basically a way <laughs> to save you from carrying around really heavy piles of money, since one you of those you, equals ten. Know, of the you know other how ones. you know how you carry around one gold, right, instead of ten mm -hmm. silver, or you know a bunch of copper, mm. a hundred copper. You know how you you know how you do that. Well, it's the same, just now it's a slightly bigger amount with the platinum. So how 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 long would it take someone to earn this much money? I mean, uh -oh. depends I, what you do. Uh -oh. I just signed back. Uh, I signed <laughs> back to Kess. Let's put it this way: and all the times we've been doing, like in the year and a half we've been doing what we do, we've never seen one. And have before I paired up with you, I have yet to ever possess one. I will give her the platinum coin. <laughs> Now, you know. now, now my eyes just go wide. I just look at her like, what the fuck? And just looking very confused. Now you, now you, now you want a platinum coin. You're welcome. I, mean, I, I nod um, no and give it back. <laughs> okay. Some people well, spend their lives... Some people spend their lives never seeing a platinum. Some people spend their lives only ever spending platinum. Okay. I mean, yeah, you've I mean, seen 10 gold, so you've seen a platinum, terrible. right? Telling me. Hmm? That mean? If you've seen 10 gold, you've seen a platinum. <clears throat> well, it's broken this... up. It's not quite the same exactly. thing. It's that, like, when we start like taking coins and stuff, like, you see that a lasman picks up like five platinum and starts looking at them and just gets a cloth out and starts shining them. Because he just like, he hasn't done that yet. Like... <laughs> How I you... have and a question. a lot harder. Mm. What's your plan with this one? Pointing at what? the dragonborn. The... We're we're going to take him back to General Kron, right? She was she was asking about the arsonists. Yes. I, I I just point out a Lazarin and Davian since they were the ones who seemed more interested in or already tasked with this kind of thing. Yeah, we'll handle this. I mean, the, is the captive awake right now still? Yeah. Awake and gagged. Yeah. Right, I punch him in the side of the head. <laughs> I mean, we will. Um... Maybe don't do that in front of the child. Yeah. I turn my back to the child and punch him in the side. <laughs> oh my god! There you go. That's I mean, much what? I mean, what? What will probably happen as well is um, maybe some room for questioning that we'll do before we get to Germal. I think It'd be nice if we had a little bit of background information going in. I and don't have. I don't. I don't trust take ungagging him. Uh, don't worry, we can all be around him as we do it. Hmm. 
We should be behind him as we do it. Well, you know what I mean. Hmm. We can be... I, I think we should get on our way to get this child back to his parents. I think we, we are. are. We're, we're, we're 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 we are, we are, we are, we are. We're like yeah. talking and, and, and okay. talking. But after like you know, I have 10 a minutes, um, you'll start, you'll, you'll, you'll see two women kind of like running up the road quite frantically and, and, and Timothy was like, Mums! Mums! It's my parents! I'm just like, <laughs> whoa, with the horses <laughs> as we stop one side of the road. I'll and, and get out of the car. Run up and they hear the cries for, for uh, uh, that Timothy like produces and they'll like run up to the carts and like, oh, our son, you've... <sighs> You're okay, and they're like <laughs> out of breath because they've been running up the road, seeing their farm like on fire. Porsche, <laughs> couldn't we couldn't save your farm? Well, that doesn't that, that doesn't matter. You 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 saved him. That's enough. What and a painting. Oh, oh yeah, they did get a painting. Well, and like pick up. I thought this might be worth oh. at least saving from the house before I tried to douse the fire. Thank you. Um, what happened? And they immediately like 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 Timothy hops out the cart and they like embrace him and uh, what you see is um, give me a second two uh, human women uh, one uh, both brown hair one very long all the way down her back uh, the other one shorter kind of like shoulder uh, shoulder uh, length uh, wearing some like common white and brown clothing <clears throat> uh, like eyes. Kind of like you can you can tell they've been crying like just because of the the idea of losing their son in a, in a fire. They, uh, some of their makeup kind of like you know smear, smearing down down their cheeks. Um, what what happened? Well, we believe it's probably in connection of a bunch of arson that's been happening in the area. You uh, have fallen victim. That's the next place to go. We've captured one of them. If it helps, we we killed the others. Who Let me set your house on one. Okay, guess. I mean, come on. Is well, that one? Is that one? One of them? Kid right and here, she, one of the the woman with the with the longer hair, kind of like points at the the gagged, tied up individual. It is. Be yes, careful. I, I also wouldn't get too um, close to anything. We are taking them to get the appropriate justice from. Yeah, unfortunately, we're going to need them in one piece. Yeah. This is still part of a bigger investigation, and any lead is better than. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Um, Bro, we will make sure justice will happen. Thank you for, for, for rescuing our son and the painting. It's a nice, it's a nice family. He's a brave lad. Mm. It's how he's raised. Um, I wish we had anything to repay you with, but that's... We you just, just lost, lost everything. 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 Yeah. I mean, What's name, so sorry by the way? about your house. That's all right. Um, hold on while I search for the names. My name's Jesse, and, and this is Ari. Um, all right, I'm Davian. She and Ari, if they test me, they sorry. I hate you. Stop. <laughs> I had stop. the same thought. I was just smiling. I to did keep not it write that head. for that reason. I did, did not stop. Stop it. I'm glad you didn't. It just immediately. I hate this. I hate this. <laughs> well, I'm. I'm a lesbian. Uh, nice to meet you. That's Kess and Brooks and Davian, Digon and Jax. Sitting. Oh, Siren. Sorry. <laughs> oh, Lazarin. Oh, you forgot your girlfriend. Oh, he's going to be in the doghouse. You forgot your girlfriend. You're sleeping Siren on the couch. Siren will remember this. <laughs> she ain't putting out for months. A Lazarin makes the notes like, I'll buy some fucking flowers when I get to her. <laughs> well, um, we'll. We'll, we'll we'll go back up there and see if there's anything we can salvage. But and they kind of both look at uh, Timothy. Looks like we're going to spend some time uh, living with the neighbors for a little bit. Is that okay with you, and Timothy? Kind I've. Of... It's all right. Oh, uh, Elijah grabbed a, a painting of yours because it seemed like it might be important. Yes, it's um it's a painting we had made uh, a couple of years ago. Uh, so Just, the family I portrait. wouldn't return for a short while. Uh, can we see the sky rising from here? Uh, yeah. Yes, you can. How long does it last? The... Eight hours, I believe. Oh, shit. The uh, perpetrators, I suppose, left some kind of message in the sky not far from your home. <clears> and 
we don't know if that might bring more of them to oh. the farm or not. So okay. you might be best... You could probably hop in the cart and we'll take you back to your neighbours if they'll have you. Um, yeah, they... they, they, they I mean, obviously, we, we, we were there when, when we saw the fire and they saw it too and they, they offered us a place to stay for at least a little while and I have some family living in Eldilon that will probably take us in for a little bit while we... Um, did our bearings, but we'd like to visit our farm first tomorrow or something to see if there's anything that we can salvage. No, we'll give it some time. Plus, yeah, we but... have some cows and stuff there, but uh, we'd probably need to deal with that too. Hopefully, <clears throat> I can't. I can't speak for the trade company or the empire or anything like that. But this arson is getting more and more widespread, so maybe they'll be compensating people who lose their farms until it's dealt with. I'm sure but... the insurance will cover it. Yeah. Hope so. Not everyone has insurance, Jax. <clears throat> um, well, I do know an insurance well, yes, lawyer. Uh, if you Very could, good. if we do fit in that cart, uh, we'd appreciate the ride back. Absolutely. And, uh, oh. uh, thank you once again for rescuing the only thing that really mattered. It'd be a bit cozy with all of us. It will be a little bit cozy, I think. Um, Maybe we'll tie this guy to the roof. We can walk. On it's not flat. No, no, no. We'll just tie this guy to the roof. Cart doesn't have a roof. It's, it's not a roof. Yeah. It, it? It's, no, just it's just a... an open cart. Like... Open cart. I've, this entire time, I've been envisioning it as like a... Mm -hmm. no, that's no, a carriage. That's a wagon. That's a wagon. Or a wagon, yeah. If it rains, you're fucked. Like, if it rains, you're fucked. You're just gonna... I mean, if it rains, you're wet. We can pitch our tent in it. True. We, always, we could always drag this guy. Back. I mean, the Lazarin's always pitching a tent in it. So next <laughs> God. kind of like it's a tight squeeze, but you know you manage to fit everybody. Uh, you drop them Kick off. Out. Kick it's out. like it's like there's like two benches, like the you know Skyrim. Yeah. Yeah. Style. It is, it is kind of and the guy type, yeah. Timothy's on Every someone's lap. The dragonborn is just on the floor, and like everyone's awake. feet, like on it, rested on him. It's just a footstool, yeah. Yeah. Before, yeah, yeah. Before they, it is a Skyrim cat. It's got the dragonborn in it. Before they, <laughs> before they like go, I'll kind of hang on. Like, it's not much, but hopefully this will help cover some sort of costs. I'll give them. Eight oh, gold. here you can have this, and I will give them the platinum coin. I'll give them eight <laughs> gold. Like, look at it. The, the, the... Are you, are you, are you sure? Absolutely, I'm not using it. And that thief over know. there. <laughs> <laughs> and they'll like, they'll like, pockets the money and thank you, you are truly... I, um... I don't know how to thank you. Rorik's dead. Stop! <laughs> like, I'm sorry, I had to, I had to. <laughs> you just wisely look after that one. We will. <clears throat> Alright. Okay. Bye. Sarah up front. As you say goodbye. To the Flanders <laughs> family. Timothy, they're coming with us for a little bit, and then we're kicking yeah, them out. Yeah, we're taking them to the. No, uh, no I thought we were there just. No, we literally just kicking them out. We yeah, literally like, just kicking them out. They're out of the neighbor's farm. They sent him goodbye. Oh, okay, okay. Farm, you yeah. fucking god damn. <laughs> so this is. Uh, you Idiot. guys take. Like say your goodbyes and continue on the road to Eldilon. We have a half a day, right? Which is still about half a day away. Anything you want to do along the way? Yes. I'm gonna take out my carpenter's tools <clears throat> okay. and whittle myself a walking stick off of the tree limb I grabbed. Nice. Nice. Um, <laughs> as it starts to get I like mean, dark, because you said we get of the captive. Oh. Yeah. What was that? Mm -hmm. no, wait, 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 wait. What was that, Quibba? I says it's like you said we won't get that like midnight, right? So is it starting yeah. to get dark? As it like when it gets dark, I'll pull out the drift globe. Oh, okay. Ooh, Ooh what's that? <laughs> and I'll kind of. Oh, that this is um, something that will help us, especially those if I assume Devi are not having a fantastic time at your site, and kind of put it to the front. Uh, and I will say, um, yeah, and it will light up. What was that? What did you? What did you say? Hmm? What was that? Well, if I say it again, it will um, activate something else. I'd rather not. It was like Hyun. Hyun. Do any of you speak Undercommon? Yes. I do. Oh. Yeah. Oh my fucking god. I want the whole fucking gang, fuck apparently. Jesus. Am I just Anyone... surrounded by secret drow? <laughs> Anyone who speaks Undercom will know that was the word for dark. Okay, what? Like... <laughs> I like the it. Fucking I dumb. It. 
it's like a floating, uh, like it's a floating, it's a blue off. orb it's that floats. Off, like... And when uh, Elasmin says that word, it starts to light up, uh, giving you mm -hmm. how much? How many? And how the... much feet of light is it again? Three hundred feet is... or something like that. Right? No, no, it's like no. sixty feet. Away. Uh, it is... Daylight uh, is the spell. No, 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 no. Yeah. It's a, can you spay, it can use daylight or just to emanate light? It doesn't actually say how much light. Well, I think it's like either... either. Wait, hold on. It's is it the light spell? Yeah, I think it's either spend? the light spell or the daylight spell. Yeah, it's the light spell. Yeah, yeah. It's, the, it's the light or daylight spell. It's using light. The Which light is 60 spell. feet. Yeah. There you go. Like 30 feet bright, 60, 30, 30 feet dim, something like that. I kind of put it at like oh, the yeah. front. Um, and I will... Then I'll say Rua. And it'll just kind of float slightly and just kind of be following the car as it goes. Is that also under comment? That no, that is yeah. elvish. Oh, okay. oh Fuck, I, don't know. I know what, what that, that says. I know what that says. What, what does it mean? Let me let me just double check. Uh, that that is the elvish word for follow. Okay, cool. There you go. Now I know. Um, All these fucking languages. While the the lights on, I'm also mm -hmm. gonna uh, sign to Kess <clears throat> that I found uh, an orange potion on the bodies, and when we're in Eldalon, we should go see what it does. I'm gonna send back probably something fire-related. an orange potion. Or maybe so a poison. Or maybe it's orange juice. I know you guys are signing. <laughs> <laughs> I can do that, but okay. uh, What did you want to do, uh, Brooks? I want to check the pockets of the cultist. Make an investigation check. Through the rope. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I feel he's unconscious, up. like... Mm -hmm. He's not like he can wiggle away from me. Just keep knocking him unconscious. unconscious. Uh, he has to keep he's knocking him unconscious. Uh, oh my investigation. god. Investigation? Yeah. 12. Uh, you find another potion, similar to the one that Daigon just showed you. I didn't show them, I just oh. signed to Kess. Sorry, Only Kess knows oh, okay, I have it. You find a potion with an orange liquid. Anyone and it's, and it's fizzy. It's, it's like fizzy. Yeah, it's fizzy. I might be able to figure it out. I'm gonna... I... Point I it go ahead, go ahead right. Kess. I'm gonna point it oh. at Daigon and be like, is that the same? And I nod. Yeah. Dragon found some on the other ones. Cool. I'll pass it to Jax. All right. And I will and cast pass identify. it to Jax. This is a potion of Sorcerer's Flame. Ooh. Okay. Which, Hi, upon bad. consumption, gives you immunity to fire damage for an hour. Ah! Oh, oh. An hour? An Holy hour. fuck. That's got to be an expensive potion. Holy shit. <clears throat> These uh, wizards. Use a lot of fire spells in the artillery, and to protect themselves for any potential blowback, they... That's smart. Carry some of those around, just in case. Okay. So it was called Sorcerer's Flame? Yeah. Potion of Sorcerer's Flame. Okay. This is, uh, quite the potion. I'll hand it back to Brooks. <clears throat> Do you tell us what it Do does? You tell us yeah, I, I, I'll just basically tell you what exactly okay, it does. Okay, okay. Okay, um, I will look around everyone in the car. From the potion to cast. Ah! Mm -hmm. Thank you. <clears throat> Realistically, I'm probably going to be fine. Those can heal. He's normally far away. She's got one, so you're the only. In all one fairness, Cass getting... tends to be quite far away up. as well. All right. Well, I I <laughs> thought it was probably a better idea to be far away from the ones that we were fighting before, but I can get up well, close I, now. I was I, I was cool going to give it. Yeah, she's the shadow it to... the shadow sword thing. I can also make swords explode out of me, and it's really cool. I haven't used it Sounds yet. Sounds terrifying. Liz, I, I was going to give it to to Dagon, given that she came back with melty face, but yep. she's got one, so. Okay. Uh, on the I will, way uh... to Babylon. Anything you guys want to do or discuss? I mean, I we'll just run the way. Rather than sending Onu up, let him sort of chill, like, I guess between Siren and I, and just, sure. you know, give him little head scritchies. Okay. Good, because you were mean to him. <laughs> he'll, like, rustle, he'll, he'll, like, he'll, like, like, rustle his feathers and kind of, <laughs> like, give you, like, one of those, like, head, head like... Are those... Mm. Do those potions exist in D&D Beyond? No. Okay. Yeah, as we're sort of, sort of going, I'll kind of look to the group master. I mean, do you want to give him gags, do you? Okay, yes. I don't want to ask him some questions. I've... Well, mm. we don't want him casting spells either. We don't want him breathing fire. Which is why we don't want him, you know, able to talk. Yeah. That's true. 
we Unless bound you want to break his fingers and then he's probably all right. He can still we, breathe we, fire we, with his fingers broken. He's a dragonborn. That's I mean, true. Realistically, you should know that as all people. You've got Actually, to start Okay. So, so hear me out. We have him Don't. facing away from us. Text. So he can breathe fire. Don't. I don't know what you're thinking. And then if he tries to cast anything, we just... But then yeah. we don't get any information from him at all. It, it would be a hurt. wiser idea to just wait until we get to Eldalon and maybe they'll have some magic to protect us. Shut up! Mm. Wait, wait, can he just make it go anyways? I mean... Which yes. We can probably... Away from us. We can probably hand him over if we to someone who has anyway. the means to question him very safely. Exactly! It's fair. Well, Just I have, a, I have no. a ability to make him always I tell the truth. Bar. That was all. Oh no, so I can make I. him. I can always make him tell the truth. Yeah, but that's not fun. <clears throat> I think it's humane, though. <laughs> also, not ethical. Shut up. Useful. Mm. Ethics okay, change okay. depending on the person. <laughs> I don't like him making noise. I really um, need to knock you out. Knock again. him out. No, do not knock him out again, for the love of God. Brooks, knock him out. He's gonna have brain no, trouble. Brooks, don't knock him out. No, do oh not God, knock him out, now Brooks. I'm torn. What does Brooks do? Brooks, do not knock him out. I'll put you to sleep right where you stand. <laughs> oh, well, now he's gonna sleep. knock him out. I, I knock him out. <laughs> Elijah's going to sleep. sleep so. it's, Br it's Brooks going to do it. I'm fucking casting sleep on him. <laughs> Absolutely. Fucking on Brooks. Like, move towards him. Fucking yeah. casting sleep. Right. He's casting oh, sleep on me. I'm no. punching this dragonborn in the side of the head. <clears throat> Do we really just like to see what goes off first, or yeah. I mean, if you spell. if you move towards him in uh, any yeah. sort of way, he's your okay. fuck. <laughs> I'm okay. going for it. Okay, roll right. high, bitch. Bitch. What is it? Well, how many? Bitch. Eight. eight. True, how many... Brooks actually has a decent amount of health. Yeah, that's... this one fire damage might be enough. Well, you took three fire bastard. damage, actually. Just yeah, such. I didn't take three fire bastard, damage. Why by not? the way. Because I have resistance to fire damage. Oh, true, because you're a fucking tiefling. <laughs> I don't Trick. know what you're talking oh, about. Oh, what? <laughs> it's on the fucking overlay, all right? Relax. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, everyone else. I don't I don't think an 18 is going to do it. I rolled no. a 7 and an 8, and then 1, 2, 2. <laughs> like, well, what, how many dice were you rolling? 5, the 8. Uh, you would have had to have rolled uh, all 7s, or because or I better. have th 34 health. It's not about your max, it's about your current. Yeah, I have 34 health. Yeah, he has a mid health. Yeah. I have a max of 35. Oh, I see. <laughs> yeah. Nothing. You don't really see me do yeah. anything. Just like, oh, well, like, you yeah, see me, I'm like, yeah, yeah. put my hand out, and then nothing happens to you. You don't, you don't feel the effect that happens on you. I was like, don't do it. Are there any components to the spell? Like, do I know that he's cast a spell on me? My I mean, dice I would have quickly maybe gone like that. There's like a bit, a bit of verbal, uh, so I might just like whisper so quickly. I'm, I'm just gonna like, make eye like, contact with him, and then like I've been, I've been like, and yeah, hold eye contact with the Lazarus. Fine stand rose petals as I just elbow it, but, this guy in the head. But it's he, he, he doesn't have to use material components because yeah. he's got. Oh, if you use um, I just meant yeah. like, is there semantic? Is arcane or... focus? It's semantic and, and verbal, but it's more like semantic. Semantic, yes. Yeah. Semantic. No, Semantic is to do with to do with the meaning of words. Yeah, that is. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Um, I'm actually sorry. You knock him out. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> Yay! Enough. Probably gonna do some serious damage. Next time, though. Next time, if he threatens to put you asleep, maybe I should just knock him out because he can't put me to sleep. I mean, I was just. He's apparently already he been arrested. There's no either. point in doing. Apparently, more... that's true. He's kind. Of, apparently, he's useless. There's empty threats. No, there's no point in already hitting a person when they're down. That's Except that he was happen. making noise, and I didn't like it. He, he was loud. Yeah. Oh he dear me, Kess didn't like he's something that someone did. Oh whoa! Will the world stop spinning? Mm -hmm. Look, a little. Even if. Even oh, if turn this car around and take us right back to the burnt <laughs> barn if you don't <laughs> shut the fuck up. Even if Kess had asked, I was annoyed by it as well. And now he's quiet and not a problem. Plus, I if he's unconscious, like... he can't be thinking about how to try and escape. Mm. You could dream about it. I just don't particularly like the, um... Should we... Hurting prisoners. Water him? It's <laughs> not a plant. No, but... People drink. 
It's true, we should. Oh, it's, it's, like, it's, a, like, it's only been a, like half a put day. Put a bag over his head and pour water on his face. No. He's no? been in our possession for almost half a day. He hasn't, you know, maybe was... Yeah, he'll, he'll be fine. I've survived without drinking water for over three, like, for three days. It's fine. Yeah, but you're also, like, made of air, so I don't... Yeah, really that has nothing to do with air. Half a day. Exactly. If, if I can, well, so, she can't really be made out of air. Otherwise, she I'm not made out I, of air. If anyone knows anything water. about dehydration, <laughs> it's the guy that drinks a shit ton of alcohol. Forget I asked for a, a living a while ago. He'll be fine. Listen, next time he comes to, we'll give him some water. It's not a bad call. We've already given him brain damage. We might as well. <laughs> yeah. I don't see there. the connection of those two things, but very well. Well, you know, oh, well, we sort of, he's a prisoner, you know, might as well just help him out a little bit, right? He's, he's got to be alive by the time we get there. <laughs> he will be. He's not going to die because he hasn't had water in half a day. It's more about the treating him like, you know, a person and not... He burns down a house with a boy, nearly... boy in it. I had to, to lift just... a beam of yeah. wood that was on fire yeah. off of a small boy. He's a fucking and horrible you monster. About treating it's him a... like a person. I mean, he's a horrible <laughs> monster, like psycho. But that's not a, a person. I, I think he that's vetoed that. vetoed that. Oh, well, listen, I I only care about him making it into the hands of some oh, horrible God. ethics. <laughs> yes. But this if Siren can weird. show some compassion for a prisoner, perhaps we yeah. should too. Exactly. I think the sooner he's out of our care, the fucking better for the poor man. Which is how it should be. <laughs> I love Kess so much, dude. <laughs> man. <laughs> I just don't even know how to respond. We're gonna wake <laughs> up, like, halfway through travel, and Kess is just gonna be there, like, putting a dagger into him. <laughs> Very slowly. <laughs> I want to- I want to see what Dragonborn blood is like. <laughs> right. so, well, that's what the spinal structure of a Dragonborn is. that said, for the sake of, uh, <laughs> Towards uh, midnight, Eldalon. You arrive at Eldalon, the biggest city in the air in 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 the province. The large stone walls with with the white stone and like the blue uh, blue. Um, what are those things called? I keep forgetting. You know, like the little like on the castle walls. Turret crenellations. Oh. Yeah, that's it true. is crenellations. That's yeah, yeah, the the rectangular little pattern Turrets. of crenellations. Maybe, yeah, like that. Spires. Um, well, the turrets are the... <clears throat> yeah, anyways. Um, instantly met by two guards at the at the gates. Uh, I guess this would be the eastern gates where you uh, where you enter. Hoarding. There you go. Uh, kind of like with, with their kite shields and their spears. Kind of like... Who goes there? Um, uh... We need to see General Kron. We have a prisoner. He's connected to the arsons. Walking what? <laughs> approaches, <laughs> what? Approaches, approaches the cart, looks at, looks at, sees you all. Okay. Right, hold on. Get the drift globe to like come like to me. Oh so right, get... are you the ones that uh, were sent to dismantle, uh, sent up to the jungle, right? Yes. 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 Okay. yes. Yeah. Was, well, okay. First of all, I'm assuming she's not the prisoner, right? Pointing at the Siren. No, 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 no absolutely not. Is this prisoner of yours related to that, or is this something different? This is this is connected to the arsons, a different thing. Well, multitasking, aren't we? Yeah, overachieving yeah. a little bit. We're very good at our jobs. Not overachieving, just... He kind of knows better that. than you. We're very, very efficient. All right, well, um... General has, has gone off duty about an hour ago, but, um... It's fine. I, oh, uh, we'll put them in your care. I mean... Probably wants to talk to you about this anyway. So, um, we'll just ride, ride, ride your cart to the keep, and we'll make sure that I'll, 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 I'll go fetch her. Uh, she's probably um, either home or, or discussing some things with with the council. Uh, so I'll, I'll fetch this her. Time. You know. Sorry. At this time. Well, let's just say that um, there's been a lot going on uh, lately, That's as you are very well aware. So the the council and us all have been working a lot more. Um, but hey, I'm not going to say no to extra pay. So, you know, is what it is. As long as you're getting paid, it's okay then. Of course. Right. And uh, lead the horses through the gate and towards the keep. All right. So, <clears throat> Kess, you're not 
If, right, you're not made of air. No, I'm not made of air. So, like, what? How? So you're are you? Huh? You're blue. Yes, I'm blue. I know air's not blue, but before I sound too stupid, but like you're are you human? But also. Because, you know, you conjure, like, wind and stuff. How does that all work? Well, i didn't, didn't Kes tell us she was a... She's talked to Siren about being a Ganassi, and Siren mentioned a Ganassi, and Davian's yes. like, but you're human. <laughs> well, actually, right, right, well, can okay, but... Become Ganassi. Yeah. Yeah, like, they are hybrids, right? Well... Yeah. Sort of, like, sort of. a human-elemental yeah, yeah. hybrid, because an air-elemental would be made of air. So... That that's kind of the line of questioning here, like, you know. Well, I'm I'm not made of air. I am, you know, a mortal. Well, I'm not an elemental. I, I suppose human's the wrong word, but like, you know, flesh and blood. Yes, and I bleed. Organs. Mm -hmm. Do you bleed red? I do. Weird. Wanna wanna see? I just I just like <sighs> go no and not and like put Let's a hand on her like not her arm. Get like, too hmm. excited. Go on, it's fine. You just prick your finger. I did it for um, for Jax the other day. Jax, do you bleed red? <laughs> I don't know, actually. Uh, I'm I'm not sure. He didn't reciprocate. Oh, what we? Hold, what? Hold on. What were you? What were you doing? I was swearing a blood oath, so he knew I was telling the truth. Did you like? No, he evil? didn't reciprocate. I just you pour it on the ground. Or on the ground. Just some okay. random fucking street cobble somewhere with your blood on it. So, uh, uh, anyway, so whoa, you are you're some you're kind you're kind of like windy, you know. I can make the wind more extreme around me, yes. Although it's technically more of an effect that only applies to me. <clears throat> I feel like I'm not really learning anything here. My blood is blue. There you go. Nice. There you According go. According to six different threads I've just read. <laughs> <laughs> the, co the common belief is either red or blue, and I'm going with blue because that's cooler. That's cool. Uh, that's purple, right in between. Yeah. Purple. <laughs> I mean, human blood is purple in the veins, mostly. Yeah, that's true. That's pretty true. It's kind of true. <laughs> Listen. I am affected by a. It looks like I'm affected by a wind at all times, but you can't feel it, right? My hair's going in a breeze right now, and you don't feel any breeze. Yeah, I think that's maybe why I got the idea that you're sort of made of air. I'm not made of air. But I'm trying her, to remember if you, if you talked about breathing blood. underwater in character or not, and I don't think you did. Yeah. Although I don't need. I don't. Well, I don't really <laughs> need to, to breathe so much. I can hold my breath forever. If I wanted to. Because you're made of air. I'm not made of air. If but if you if were, you, you'd but never But if I were, out. I would not need to breathe at all. If you're holding... Blue doesn't need to breathe. Breath Wait, how close forever. is Kess sitting to the front of the cart? Uh, probably quite close. <laughs> Let's just, like, lean back and, like... <laughs> and like, serious, run my hand serious, through, your, kind of through your wavy hair. <laughs> just, like... <laughs> just, like, make sure it's corporeal, like... <laughs> Whoa, do would I feel a breeze? Like, or is it just it just looks like it's wind sweat? That's so weird, dude. It just looks like it's blowing in a wind. It's like her really looks like the glamour spray. shots of every photo shoot ever. <laughs> she would make she would make a brilliant shampoo commercial. Fucking yeah. yeah, actress doesn't need all that extra production either. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe she's made of air. <laughs> Maybe she's Maybelline. Maybe, Maybe it's, it's Maybelline. A... Maybe she's okay. like a assy. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> it and we ride to the keep oh. to see <laughs> the. Oh, before we ended the show, by the way, I meant to oh. do this. Oh. Uh, I want to disguise mean, myself. Wanna... Okay. Ooh. Uh, I'm just gonna be an old man. Okay. Old human man. Classic. Decent beard, you know. Nice. Are we, are uh, we... Nice. Are we going to see Kron first, or? Uh... Mm -hmm. We're going well, to the keep, and they're going to go and get Kron. We yeah, need to get this it? prisoner off our hands. So. Kron's already on the way, so it's a bit late to do anything else. As you, arrive, be... at the, as you arrive at the keep, you kind of get told to wait, like a uh, like by the front uh, entrance, like uh, to get told to put your cart and horses like to the side. 
Um, Maybe Tron Lee was and here as well. uh, a guard Ooh. walks up to you. Uh, what could I do for you? Where we were sent here to wait for General Kron because we have a prisoner. Oh, is someone already fetching up? Uh, yes, one of the guards from the from the gate. Right. All right. Um, yeah, just stick around here then, and um, you know, don't don't get in any trouble. Uh, just out of curiosity, what, what what did the poor bastard do? Set a, a house on fire with a small boy in it. What? Don't feel bad for him being gagged and tied up then. All right. And he no. tried to kill up few of us so mm. Mm, right. he did do that i was just wondering you know whether because he's gagged and tied up and is he conscious i don't even know so i just wanted to make sure that there was a lot of humane he's um, sleeping because you know it's it's night time and very tiring yeah. day for him you know right, setting right. buildings of on course fire. of course i mean you know if it's sitting building on fire with children in it and we didn't want him really to cast any magic shit about so. what happens to him really um exactly see he gets it um you know i mean I keep him alive but you know yeah um, well, you just didn't hear that from me. Uh, right. Uh, oh, there's the general. There she comes. Uh, <laughs> and he like goes back to his position. What's your name, Sergeant? Have good. Ah, uh, war crimes. Am I right, general fellow? I want your walks up to right uh, the cart. No not wearing, not wearing her armor. Here. She's 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 now is wearing some like like white and blue uh like common clothing. Uh, still has like her her rank like kind of like shown on it, but it's by no means protective in any way it's like it's just like some normal clothes that she like wears when she's not on duty good um, stand up straight and give her a little evening. salute good evening I'm sorry to disturb your evening in such a way but... i i mean i uh i hope it's for good news uh, you're alive right yes excellent we're alive and the yuan t uprising is not yes very good we killed the guy who was betraying the city we killed the guy who was in charge oh, of the one team we killed we, we have his, their heads we killed we pole. killed uh a hydra about, like yeah decomposing this is going disgusting. very fast calm down one at a time okay. hydra yes dead who's this and uh, she points at Sirin. oh uh, he was found just up the road um she no, Sirin. 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 Oh, Elijah, sorry, you're sorry. really fucking up today, man. Oh, sorry. Yeah, it is. Uh, that, oh, that, that was never going to dance again. That again. was me. No, no, she's never going to dance again. again. Oh, this is no. Siren. Very fit. Right, Con. Fuck. I'm Siren. Um, Siren helped um, us kill the yeah. other people. I'm supposed to be a diplomat for her tribe. Well, there's. A council meeting happening uh, in Tranio's house <laughs> right now. If you want yeah, to bring the news, oh, shit. Um, yeah. I'll, I'll I'll accompany you. I'll, I'll let my men take this guy in. This guy, what did he do? Set a, a farmhouse awesome. on fire. Oh, the arson of. Um, there was a boy in it. Oh, um, oh okay. Uh, well, in that case, I'll, I'll. She like calls the two guards that are, like kind of like guarding like the the the, the entryway into the keep. Tells them to take the prisoner in. And uh, she escorts you to Tranliel's house. Um, <clears throat> opens the door with a key that she has. And uh, you get led into a the same room with like the big circular table where you were last time uh, sitting at, like trying to like compare the handwriting, like that same room. And what you see is uh, a handful of people. You see Tranliel, obviously, at, uh, in the in the in the back, like at the like furthest away from the door, in her chair. You see an older, like, graying, graying human, tan skin, um, to her left. You see Father Ackle, the head of the temple. Um, you see a tabaxi, uh, wearing black leather, like, coat, hat with a big feather on it. Um, uh, General But I'm Krom assuming they have hair. Yes. <laughs> Uh, it's like that tip, like that classic, like, like cheetah, uh, yeah, print. Yeah, yeah. some boots! Um, General Kron goes to sit down in her seat, and you see, um, another person. Let me quickly fucking get the description for you. Give me a sec. Um, <clears throat> a woman, uh, pretty tall, like, as she's sitting down on her chair, she, she towers, like, over anyone else that's sitting uh, around the table. 
Lady Dimitrescu? Uh, <laughs> no, no. Uh, Broad-shouldered, <laughs> pale skin. Mommy, uh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> mommy, sorry, uh, mommy. Uh. Pale, pale skin, white hair, like medium length, kind of, with a part in the middle. Oh my god. Um, uh, wearing very fine clothing, uh, red and gold finishes and details, uh, with a golden dragon head with a coin in its mouth on the chest, uh, the emblem that represents the uh, trade company. So you get the sense that this might be Primus Dalashari. Uh, they all look at you as General Kron goes to sit down, and Tranliel gets up from her seat. Welcome back. It's good to see you all in one piece. Um, and you brought a guest, too. So, talk to us. Well, we... We went to the Yuan-Ti. Uh, we tried to find... The, the person we, we've we discovered Jeremiah. from the... Jeremiah. Jeremiah. We tried to find Jeremiah, but he right. has been turned into a monster. So uh, we followed him into the jungle, um, killed him, uh, the leader of the, the evil Yuanti, and a Hydra, and then a scared Hydra? away all the followers at that point. Yes, that was a Hydra. No longer. You to tell the tale? I, I signed a cast. Show the heads. Show the heads. We have heads. I oh, oh, and I'll, I'll pull out the disgusting, like, half decomposed heads out of the yeah. bag. <laughs> you can see, like, the entire table kind of, like, jaws drop. And... Put those away. Um, we thought you'd want the proof. I'll do it. No, it's fine. Okay. <laughs> I'm it's my acid baths. Um, well, um, you've, you've caught us in the middle of a council meeting. Uh, this is my council of five. They help me make decisions in the city and in the province. Uh, I'll make some introductions. Um, the man to my right uh, is Peter Riz, leader of the Kalzus Adventurers. Um, beside him, you've met Father Ackle, right? Mm, yes. Uh, uh, Peter Riz, not Father Ackle. <laughs> <laughs> Over there, uh, Primus Dalashtari of the Trade Company. The tabaxi is uh, Captain Blackpaw, the High Sea Protectors. And obviously we have General Kron. And everyone kind of like like nods and gives you a hello. It's nice to meet you all. So, um, you are sure that it's done, right? The yes. war efforts, the, 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 the threats to my life and the city. As, they as... have no one to rally around anymore. And while she's saying this, I sign... Make sure to emphasize that Siren was critical in her aid. Very helpful. Siren here was uh, absolutely detrimental to the efforts. She really no opposite her. opposite word. Detrimental's no. bad. Oh, to their efforts. efforts. To their efforts. Their efforts, not their. ours. Theirs. She no. helped us dis dissemble all the Siren. Yes. Mm. Okay. Interesting. We don't. We don't get many. Uh, sorry, uh, Sirin. This is not nothing. Nothing personal. We just don't get many Yuan-Ti in our city walls that don't try to kill people. So this is uh, new. I will oh, put my hand on Sirin's back, and I'll kind of slightly <laughs> push her forwards and cast <laughs> guidance. Like now's your time to. Sirin kind of like lift. yeah, like looks at you, uh, like and then looks at looks at Tranliel and the rest of the table. Yes. Um. I come from a settlement in the jungle, um, Sethka. We rebelled against my people's lust for war and death, and um, have some working relations with the city of New Daramuth. And after I've met this group who saved my life uh, out in the jungle I aided them as a uh, as a return to return that favor and um, I, I, an idea occurred to me where it might be beneficial for both your city and my people if we set up somewhat of a collaboration similar like we have with New Daramuth where um, I might uh, I learn how the city functions, I I, I study you all uh, and just the city life, and 
find a way to get some working relations going between my people and yours. And she kind of like looks at the around the table and looks at the ground and looks back at you, Elazarin. Trinayel kind of over overlooks like all of you, and some of the people around the table kind of like start like whispering to each other and Trinayel kind of Given how these people vouch for you. That is something that we can make happen. Um, how about we give you a place to stay in the city? There's a few houses available. And you come up with something a little more tangible, a plan, ideas, and we'll bring it to the next council meeting, which will invite you to as well, and we can discuss this. And Siren kind of nods her head. All right. Um, with that said, it's time for payment for a job well done, I suppose. And she kind of like claps, claps her hands, and uh, the door swings open, and, and just a servant comes Good in. Good question. Huh? Quick question. I yes. can't remember if this was said around the group or if this is something that only they would know because at least Elazarin and Davian were told to deliver a message about the fires and needing mm -hmm. Eldewant aid. Was that without the group or was that with the group? That around? was just me. Who that was, was just Elazarin. Elazarin. Okay. Okay. Just me. Okay. Cool. Make, I couldn't remember if that was a Laura memory or a Dagon memory. Okay. Cool. <clears throat> so keep continue. Um, Don't worry. I'm, the I'm... servant <laughs> opens the door and enters the room and Tranliel tells him Fetch the uh, rewards for these fine people that I've set aside, and he, and a few minutes later comes back, and and puts the puts like a, a a big chest on the table and like slides it to Tranliel, and she opens it. All right. Um, who do we go? F oh, where do we go first? Where do we go first? Ah, um, Jax, right? Yes. You seem, and I've been told. You're a man that likes to make things. Uh, I, I, I am. All right. I present you with this uh, this item, and she hands you a small rod. This is a magic detector. Ooh. If there's any any magical items in your vicinity, when you opt to use the the detector, it'll grow. It'll glow bright blue. Right. Um, it allows you to cast Detect Magic at will without expending a spell slot. Damn! Um, let's go. Big fuck! <laughs> Your purpose is gone. What, what's the official every, name every room we walk into. Uh, it's a magic detector. It's a custom item that I made. I have, I've made it all on uh, on, on D&D Beyond, so I'll just assign them to your character sheets after the after the session. Cool. Dope. Um, Appreciate you. Yes? Yes. That's me. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Chanliel, uh puts pulls out a leather-bound purple book. This is something uh, called a comprehensive guide. Uh, it allows you to um, understand languages, uh, mostly written. Uh, speech is a bit harder, but written language, uh, you'll find it all in this book. Uh, what that does, it makes you able to cast comprehend languages without using a spell slot. Yay! Daigon, for you we oh. have these uh, these bracelets, and uh, these are silver bracelets, and some, some dragon decorations. Uh, they're called dragon armlets. These bracelets are connected by these five chains. Uh, they're meant to be worn on the same arm. You're um, becoming Shang Chi from the Ten Rings. Let's go. While you wear them, you'll be able to um, deflect spells. As you would arrows Dang. or bolts. Oh, <gasps> use a key point to deflect spells? It huh? allows you to use your deflect missiles feature against a ranged spell attack, uh, but only once per day. Once per long. Okay. Rest. Damn. Your magic missile, not anymore. Ranged spell <laughs> attack? <laughs> only yeah, once. It, it allows her to, for once per day, like fireball. use no, deflect that missiles on a spell cool. attack instead of uh, like just pier or like arrows or bolts. For That's fucking cool. That's fireball, dude. That's so cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, Elazrin? Oh, yes. I present you with 
A ring. Yeah. It's a shiny silver ring embedded with a blue sapphire. Figured you'd appreciate this with your background. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a ceremonial ring. It allows you to cast ceremony once every long rest without using spell slot. Yeah. It really is a marriage ring. <laughs> it's not in that <laughs> way. Brooks, you seem like uh, someone that likes to get up close. And I've seen you carry some hand axes around, if I'm not mistaken, right? Once or twice. I give you this hand axe. It's a metal hand axe, blue hand grip. It's called the Hand Axe of Thunderwave. Functions like any normal hand axe would, but allows you to cast the Thunderwave spell once every long rest. Pretty fucking cool. With a safety seal of 13. Mm. <laughs> Better than me, if I was casting. Yeah, our, our saves are like 11 and 12. Um, we don't have great saves. <laughs> 14. Davian? Same. The Longbow of Entangle. And as she kind that of pulls sick. pulls pulls the bow out, it's a uh, it's a longbow wrapped in vines, and it functions as a normal longbow would, but allows you to cast entangle once every long rest without using a spell slot. Uh, using your own Thank spell you. save DC. Very much. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I believe that concludes our business here. Thank you very much. What about Siren here? Well, I wasn't prepared, first of all, but uh, second of all, I just offered her a place to stay in the city. Uh, I think that's yeah. we'll do for that's, now. <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. You know, you're absolutely right. Um, one small thing, given the mm -hmm. events of the last couple of weeks. Yes. Might it be too much to ask for maybe a guard detail, at least for a short while, for her? Um, she'll look around the table. And uh, I suppose, as a UNT, with what happened recently, that some people might not understand. That is true. Um, she looks at uh, General Kron. Yeah, I mean, um, I'll be able to sort that out. Or maybe, how is she in? A, how is she in a fight? And Siren pipes up. Oh, I. Um, quite pride myself at being a decent ranger, skillful with a bow. You can turn to a tree. Is that not something for you, Peter? And Peter looks at Siren. Yes, I believe we uh, we could use people with that skill set at the Kalzir Adventurers. Similar to uh, similar job descriptions. What you've done now, um, you'll have a place to stay, you'll you'll make some friends, can make some extra money while you're not studying and thinking of this this, this business proposition. Siren kind of... The next couple of days, we'll be sort of showing her around and stuff, so... Yes, of course, that is fine. Like, she's not contractually obliged to, to join us, but just, you know... Uh, no, of course. She wants to make a little money while she's in the city and uh, find some... meet some people. Um, we're a social bunch, and... Inclusive. And Siren kind of looks and I sh I could give it a try. Okay. With that said, um, it's getting very late. Thank you very much Ooh. for your service. Um, should there be any other anything else uh, you wish to discuss regarding anything, uh, you're always welcome to. Pop by. Uh, but first, I think you all deserve a few days off after all the things you've been through. There's just sorry, one more thing I would like to bring up. Um, yes. The guards at Southwold um, mm -hmm. want for like a proper investigation open into the fires, and if you send some help, the fires are getting closer and closer to Eldalon. They're getting more and more severe. That's so. Ron? Ron looks up. Make work of it, first thing in the morning. <clears throat> Hopefully you'll get some answers from that prisoner. Hope so, but the uh, last one didn't really speak much. I doubt this one will. True. He was fucking noisy enough on the way here. Ugh. Oh, I, I signed to cast 
tell them about the sky message that the name the name oh. that was in it <clears throat> they um during our fight they wrote in the sky when it became clear that most of them were going to die um about a, a lord fearcrog yeah yes. Geodin. saying mission complete mm -hmm. We're aware of that individual, as uh, some of your friends already know. Um, All right. They can tell you the story. I don't really can't be fucked repeating it. That's fine. Um, he's um, this is this is a problem, and I mean, there's a bounty on his head if you're willing to, you know. It's just saying. If a bounty's more shit like this, then we'll be f well hard pressed to collect on that. Uh, something to consider. There's a bounty on his head, and uh, you've already dealt with the investigation, or like you've already dealt with these people a couple times now. So, just uh, you know, after your, you know, just, just something to think about. Well, well, I don't suppose any dance halls will be open this late. No. Uh, it's a shame. I don't think so. Oh, maybe, um, maybe the body boat. There's just some, 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 they, they like to throw a party and lots of, lot of students go there to drink because it's cheap. Uh, if you're lucky, maybe. Ooh. A lot of fights too, which is fine either way, but. Mm. Man, love you, rowdy students, right? We killed a Hydra, yeah. so yes. It's part of the fun. Oh, don't <laughs> kill them. No, no. That would be bad. Although I don't we know, um, it's a good idea to bring Siren there, given that. Yes. Know, like we go. Uh, I assume. We are obviously we are an inclusive city, and uh, there's a lot of strokes for a lot of different folks and all that stuff. But um, even that, the Imperial emissary almost got assassinated by her people. There's going to be nobeds they won't understand. Combine that with some alcohol, and you know, and they get the shit kicked out of him. I mean, yeah, obviously, obviously, rightfully so. But I just don't want her to feel, you know, uncomfortable or, or scared, or you know. But, but that's that's up to you to decide. Anyway, I'm just 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 saying. Um, right. Thank you very much. And the entire table kind of um nods. And the the tall woman with the white hair, and uh, you know the owner of the of the trade company. By the way, next time you break into my trade company, try not to pretend you're blessing the place. It's a bit rude. <laughs> I don't think killing a massive fucking beast underneath it was anything but blessing it, if you ask me. That's absolutely That's... true absolutely true that was very grateful but uh you're welcome we take you know the worship of the golden lady very seriously around there so i just don't just wanted to elijah did you bless it or not i did indeed I if there's one person oh, who takes the it. worship of the golden lady seriously it's elijah here and he will do a bang up job every time in fact he blessed someone all you. what his coins are very shiny what very is shiny. she um wearing the <laughs> What are you wearing? She got a nip. No, yeah. Are you talking about uh, Dallas Shah? Yeah. The woman. Uh, she's yeah. wearing these like like red and gold robes with like the trade company emblem. And underneath. Dragon head no. uh, with. No. She, is she, gold I can't coin. like see uh, her like shoulders or anything. Uh, no. Okay. <laughs> a woman of the council <laughs> showing her shoulders. Uh, <laughs> you want to see Let her just... shoulders? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> she... Sorry. Quick question. Next, you'll be asking to see her ankles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, is she saying this in front of all the council, or is she saying this like outside as we're leaving? No, or this, this is in front of everybody. Like it seems that Yikes. they talk to her about yeah, everything. She's calling that us happened. out. She's but... calling us out. I mean, it oh, was boy. state sponsored. Yeah. I know, like Tranley yeah. told us to do it, but like yeah. it's still a bit of a yikes. <laughs> I assume we didn't damage anything knows. besides the no. massive fucking beastie. So as, as she's saying this, I signed a kiss. Do you think? Do you think Peter knows? I'm gonna sign back up. About what? About the, about the thing similar to this thing? No, I don't think so. Okay, let's hope. I 
think I would have mentioned it otherwise. You're signing that in front of everybody, right? <laughs> yep. Well, no, but this time I do the angle thing because I had been burned mm, by this before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The I've angle. been caught by this before, where I like. If you're about to make a slight of handshake. Yeah. I think you might have uh, to no. make a slight of handshake on that one then. That's <laughs> fair. <laughs> That's fair. That one incoming. <laughs> it is here, more. Here we go. It's not a that one. It is single digits. Uh, it's single. That's, oh, that's an 11. The other tabaxi. Like the guys are single digits, but the... Oh, fuck! Yeah. Yeah. Captain Blackpaw. Black oh, it's not Peter, so it's fine. Looks, looks at you and kind of like... Gets up. And oh, kind no. of like as the entire room, like, People is it getting ready to leave, walks past you, kind of just whispers in your ear. Next time you got to make sure nobody else knows sign language. And then just kind of walk, walks off. Oh. I, just like, I just like look at him like, fucking god damn it. Like, I know you're right. I'm not mad. I'm just annoyed. I'm just like, damn. <laughs> <clears throat> And uh, that, the money with that, well, Siri, I don't want like, to leave you. Drains and uh, everybody kind of gathers in front of the house and have some like some more small talk before everyone eventually, like the entire council, kind of disperses. Father Ackle approaches you, uh, Lazarin. Uh, and I um wanted to thank you again for for the help with the parade, and I never really got the chance to to thank you properly because of everything that happened. Um. Are you? Uh, what are your plans regarding your, your stay in the city? How long will you be? Uh, will you be staying? I am hoping to plan to stay a couple of days. Nothing too major. Um, and obviously, if it's not any harm to your time, um, Siren here is very interested in um, our you. religions. Um, so, if at some point, if you could either, maybe not even yourself, but could have someone help you around past the face that you know, I know much about the Golden Lady, but my knowledge on of the course, other um, face aren't um oh how about you both just, just come come by uh the temple tomorrow afternoon or something of course yes of course take care have a, have a good evening you too as um <laughs> both father Aqua and the primus leave mm -hmm. i can i like see if i can see any tattoos at all on who both of them oh uh make a perception check oh yeah Secrets. Well, no. <laughs> I don't suppose anyone could disguise Sirin. I, um, uh, I think Brooks can. I don't want to. <laughs> I'm not going to hide who or what I am. City is just going to have to learn to accept the fact that there's friendly you want to out there. <laughs> I understand, but well, they already advise against going to the muddy boats. It's one thing to you know start living in the city and going about your day to day, but. A rowdy tavern at night is a very different place. Lazarin, what do you think? Uh, difficult one. I think it's... Don't need to go full disguise, but maybe just a slight cover might... At least at first. Maybe for the first day or two. Just I, I, I'm saying just I, for tonight, nothing, honestly. Nothing, nothing I, too major. I'm not saying to completely cover yourself. You should be free to see you are, but mm -hmm. unfortunately, not everyone's as open as us or others. There are people well, there who will see anything that's different and want to persecute it. Well, Lazarus it's up to you, though. That, mm -hmm. If you're, I want to sign to Kess. Maybe though, would it look worse if someone sees her and sees her trying to hide her identity, and that feeds into stereotypes? Of her pur of the purpose of what she's doing here, wouldn't it be better to be open? I'll repeat that. <clears throat> I'm not. That's an excellent point. I'm not There's... saying to like fully cover. It's like putting up a hood. Nothing. Not like you know, dark way every shadow. Obviously, keep the features still be able to be seen. Just my not. Tongue in my mouth and my eyes closed. Just, you just take it from me that like, you don't have to be ashamed of who you are. But there's definitely value in 
being careful with it sometimes. It's not about shame or pride. I mean, it's just about not getting the shit kicked out of you by a bunch of racist students in an alley. I mean, that's really all I have to say. I mean, we could just Although, not go to the rowdy that, pub, to be fair. Although, that happen, we would kick the shit out of them instead, so... I'm mm -hmm. I mean, here with us. If, if it just... comes to it, we'll just... You know. He's very scary looking. I was going to say, oh, what we can even do? Stop the hiding, we just go so straight he... into the room. Go straight into... You know? Where we've got... Where we've got... Nowhere safe. Into tavern wise, just go straight up. Don't have to go out partying every night. I could do. I, I could mean, do with a rest in. To be fair, if you do, do want to go out at some point, then you know I can always. Where, where do you guys stay? Password amongst the staff. We haven't decided yet. Where, where should we stay this time? Cup. What? The, we, can um, afford, we, normally, we can afford. We can afford the glossy carafe or whatever the fuck it is. Last time we stayed yeah, at the friendly giant. Uh, if mm -hmm. we wanted to be classy, we'd go to the elegant carafe. Elegant, not gilded. Mm -hmm. Stupid. Uh, but failing that, you know, if we want to be cheap, weaving mug or a muddy boat. The weaving mug was pretty great as well, though. Yeah. Weaving mug was not. The friendly giants got better atmosphere and better people. Okay, it's a whole house. house. It's not a whole house. It's it's, it's a, a whole, whole house. house. You can't rent a room for the night at a whole house. You go, you fuck, you leave. Uh, a place where you can get services Rim. from other people. A whorehouse is a place where you go in, you pay for like an hour, you, can pay you for fuck the whole someone, night. or you get fucked, and then you leave. Oh, um... The Friendly Giant is a tavern that just also happens to have people there that you can pay to spend the night with you if you want. That's a business? Well, it's Very not... a profitable business. Well, it's oldest profession. Mm. What's, what's, what's the job called? Prostitution. Uh, gets, her parts, gets her parchment out and writes prostitution. <laughs> I, I, Does she have like it, a column of jobs to try? It depends. Some, peop it? some people are very blunt with it. Some people don't like to use that sort of term. Right, what term would you... Uh, that's the job description. Uh, I believe they prefer ladies of the night. Sure, that's a title, but not a description. Whores. That's <laughs> rude. <laughs> not everyone that goes into a room with one of the lasses or lads at and the giant has sex with them, you know, like they're a... oh, they're escorts, right? Yeah, actually, they're they're company for hire, but Brooks doesn't like it when you call them whores, <laughs> they're his friends, <laughs> they are his friends. Well, he might be one as well, so <laughs> if, you, if, you have, if you have to keep on paying them for them to hang out with you, are they really Jax, <laughs> It would take a lot more money than everyone has in their pockets for this to happen. It... I That's true, most that. of my platinum is not in my pockets. Well, yes. I just don't want to, you know, put a damper on your night. Um, okay, I could just talk. go to the tavern you all stay at and uh, get to know the people there while you out, go out partying. Now, Elijah and I have spent a night in the Elegant Carafe, and it is Elegant very is nice. Probably ostentatious, I'll tell you that much. I, I'm gonna sign to cast balls, that though. there is also the weeping mug if people want to save I, money, but less definitely less fancy and less savory. I am a fan. Yes, I prefer to go to the weeping mug, to be honest. Are you uh, actually last wait? Last time, time we the weeping mug have baths. It has a Or was that? Huh? We mug have baths, didn't it? It had like a little downstairs area. Oh, you said bath. Yeah. Uh. Last time oh, we bathed, the carafe definitely the has giant, bathing because right? you guys yeah, like, that was like a big. I swear big the mug deal. has it as well. Cause... I don't know about mug. I think the giant might. No, the, the giant. I'm sure we. I'm sure we all stayed at the giant at one point. And uh, we have. We have. We did. We did. We, did. Well, we, did. we, did. Yeah. we stayed at the mug and the giant because because yeah. uh, the giant we didn't have a communal bath. Giant. It had individual bathing rooms because you could mm -hmm. yeah. take company. Yeah, yeah. yeah. bathhouse. Uh, I mean, it, if the mug doesn't have baths, we could just go to a bathhouse. Hmm. That's true. I mean, the temple has. Right. So. Okay. That's true. That's where we bathed last That's time. Really <laughs> yeah, Drink, yeah. Drinks at the boat, and then we'll have a night of luxury. We'll stay at the carafe. Drinks oh, at the I boat, don't... go to the carafe. We should probably get rooms at the carafe before we go and to the go. boat. But I don't no, know how Don't worry. I'll, I'll get us rooms at the at the carafe. I'm not really fancy going out drinking. I need okay. A, you need night then. So I'll go get Well, you and Siren then. You can go. stay to the carafe. No, I've stayed. Elijah and I. I can't remember for the life of me how much is it a room? Couple gold. Hey, DM, how much is it for a room? Because <laughs> it hasn't. Probably about 
I think it was like two gold or five gold uh, or something. Yeah, that was like five. Uh, I think it was like five gold for a room, yeah. It's like five yeah. gold. If they say this out loud, my eyes just widen and I sign to cast. I I'm. I'd Did you also really pay like two or three gold for like a one like course Great. of your dinner? Yeah. Or some oh shit. yeah, wild, yeah. We took oh, our yeah. we took our first bounty and we fucking splurged, dude. <laughs> I'll pass like a last three, three platinum. course meal in like a fucking Michelin star restaurant and hotel. Yeah. <laughs> I will pass a Lazarus in the platinum and ask him to get room for me and anyone else who's going for drinks. I will pass him two platinum. I am gonna sign to Dagen. Do you just want to stay at the mug for the rest of the group? I nod yes. We have friends there anyway. Are you sure? I, um, I, I, I've got the rooms for the night. We can't hear this. They're signing. Oh, you should. Fuck. Fuck. Right. <laughs> Bitch. God, I hate you. One so. day, we'll it will get to session 18 and we'll still be doing this shit. We'll while, like, while they're signing. Oh, that, like, oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, while they're signing, me and, me and Jax are like, well, there we go. That should, that should cover rooms for all of us. Don't get any rooms for me and Dagon. We yeah. already... <sighs> Why not? You'll trust me. You'll you always know. share my room, Kiss. <sighs> really? Hey. <laughs> I mean, it's only a couple nights. And Jax is covering it anyway. That's true. That's true. Trust me. This is the sort of thing that you definitely, Kiss, and probably you as well, Tygen, will enjoy. It's I... very. On it, Kiss. Even. You just want me in your bed. That's not yeah, true. I said it. <laughs> You said it. <laughs> but if there's one person that's suited to the elegant carafe here, it's probably you. Okay. You did that in the forest for. Unless it's the last time you're like, fuck. Dagon, if you absolutely <laughs> fucking hate it, then, you know, I'll take you somewhere else. It'll be fine. But. Uh, Two hours like in one a, night, I'm doing well. I just do like a, like a kind of dejected, like shoulder slump and exhale, like a fine. Okay. Is it, is it the cost that's putting you off or the idea of being in fancy tavern i just do the a gesture like this like rubbing coins together to imply it's okay i can pay for dagon trust me i have more we've already we have paid a lot of money we've been in the we've been in the jungle for fucking days we've been on the road for days we definitely need a night at least one night in a very nice bed <laughs> why are you giggling no reason. <laughs> I, I gave Elijah and a platinum, so think of it as I've covered your room, Dagon, because you bought me a drink or whatever. That's true. And you now did. you don't have to worry about how much it costs because mm -hmm. it didn't cost you a penny. I just uh, signed a Kess mental note. Brooke's very bad at math. The drink was <laughs> definitely not that much. Just pretend it was. It's fine. So we're agreed then. Yes. They we're all gonna go get steaming in a shithole and then uh, go back to come back. Absolutely. I, I think absolutely. I'll probably get you double rooms if, just to save a bit of cost rather than buying six separate, if that's okay. Mm -hmm. No, I would, I would mm -hmm. like a room to Well, myself, I'm staying but... with Davian, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> you want a room to yourself, do you, Brooks? Absolutely. Okay. Like you'll be sleeping alone. <laughs> I just signed a. I just. I just look, like go stand next to Cass and look at Davian. Like, duh. Obviously, she won't be. <laughs> I was talking about Brooks. <laughs> talking about Brooks. Oh, I thought you meant Cass. My bad. Uh. <laughs> oh, you know what? It still works. I'll fucking figure something else. Something out when I get there. And I just, oh, just enjoy your night. Enjoy. The last is will probably want to share a room. I want a separate room. I'm assuming either you two are, are going to share or have a separate room. Uh, Davian, Elasrin. No. I will sign to Kess. If you did ever, by the way, if you don't want to be roommates, that's that's fine. Like, it, just in case you ever feel like I'm <laughs> cramping your sock. style. Just you know? hang your sock up and don't knock. Yeah. <laughs> just scratch and knock. And then I also sign, but I, I will say, I think Davian needs to be nicer to you if you're going to spend time in his room. I'm just saying. And that's his sign <laughs> language, obviously. <clears throat> It's like something a bit nasty. What's the bud? Now <laughs> <laughs> Animals just don't like you. <laughs> right, off we go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's fucking um, go. All right, so oh, I like, will uh, yet again or... bud in a Lazarin with Onu. For oh me. my god. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so oh. who's going to the to the carafe right now? Uh, Lazarin and Siren. Lazarin and Siren. Oh no, okay. just Siren. Siren will go where the fuck she wants to go. Oh, Siren, 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 Siren will join you. Siren will join you. Yeah. Siren's gonna go with her husband. This is your time to apologize for the introduction <laughs> debacle. Yo, flowers? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so. Expensive drinks. 
you all oh. uh, go your separate ways, uh, Lazarin and Siren. You uh, make your way to the carafe. Uh, as you enter, there is this high elf, long blonde hair, uh, kind of tied in a bun, a man, behind like the the, the reception like counter. Good evening. What can I do for you, uh, sir and madam? We're going to be needing a couple of rooms. A group of us. We've gone out drinking, but um, oh, is that so? Getting rowdy in the night. Oh yes, you know, <laughs> quite the quite the event. Um, right. Just need some rooms. Uh, how many rooms please. and how many people are, are there? Are um, there to be seven expected? of us total. total. Uh, so we'll three probably doubles and a single. That sounds perfect. All right. Um. Since there's so many of you, are you uh, going to be uh, making use of, of the bathing and, and yes, food in the morning and drinks, maybe? Uh, yeah, most probably. All right, well, how about this? You are a returning customer, correct? I'm pretty sure Hi. you've been here a couple of weeks ago, if I'm not mistaken. I have been. I recognize the get-up. It's, it's not every day we get uh, somebody so obviously um, a follower of the Golden Lady. So... Thank I'll uh, cut you a little bit of a, of a discount. Um, normally, it would be five gold a room, uh, food and drinks not included, and obviously... So, for you and your friends, for Platinum, that includes all the rooms, use of any amenities, and free drinks and breakfasts. Oh, well, like, well, not free, what? but like included. Wow. So uh, open, open bar, and and yeah, all you can eat. I'm gonna open make you get a longer span. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Uh, oh, yes. Absolutely, yes, sir. Done. There you go. Thank you very much. And um, I will turn him the three pattern I was given by the others, and then one very shiny. <laughs> he hands you, he hands you uh, my four keys. You'll be staying on the uh, third floor in rooms. Uh, 31 through 34. Yo, dibs on 33. <laughs> oh, I've spiced. I want to take room 33 now. But <laughs> <laughs> Jokes on you guys. 33 is a single. Well then. Um, thank you very much. Uh, You're welcome. I'll enjoy your stay. Um, I'm going to quickly run to where they are and give them their room keys. I think that'd probably be Rather than try and wait for them to, you know. Lazarus run. just running to the muddy boat. <laughs> yeah, literally. Could, could you not, literally. Would they not is hold them about, at the front desk when we got there? Or is, no, I guess that would be it. about 2,500 feet away. Yeah. Uh, well, the dock district is pretty close to like the, the, the rich, stinky, rich uh, district of town, so it's not too far. So it uh, only takes it's, like, it's like a five minutes. minute walk to quickly get to the docks, and that's where the muddy boat is. Okay. It's a three and a half minute jock. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, Allegedly, before you, before you leave, Siren will yeah, okay. kind of like ask and like, don't want to be weird, but would you mind sharing rooms for the night? That's absolutely fine. Hey. And I she'll like that make her way up to the room while you. Um, like, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll give her, I'll give her room ring. number thirty-two. Okay. There you go. Uh, Are you gonna show her your new ring? Oh my <laughs> god! Unbelievable. Oh, I hate it. this fucking. I hate <laughs> you. We're fucking adults. That's your name. I'm for gonna. You. Yeah, I will. That's canonically I hope we're in adults. sign language. <laughs> okay. I I will. Which one was the single room? Uh, thirty-four. Thirty-four is a single. Cool. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I will. I'll just run back to the group and be like, oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> Got your keys and give Brooks number thirty-four, and then just kind of put the others on the table and be like. Tell him. Bonk. Have a good night, Siren. Um, I'll have a good night. <laughs> He's like, fuck y'all, bye. Runs <laughs> back to... Bonk. <laughs> okay. Um, so while last one's running back, you guys uh, at the Muddy Belt, you've, you've gotten your keys. So you, you have a couple of drinks. Um, anything you guys want to do or discuss? Or, or, um, you know? Before we went in, I wanted to activate my armor and sneak off. Oh. We're oh. like we're like walking up to the bar and fucking Jack's like <laughs> runs to a tank and just rolls down the street. Why do you do me like that, okay. Uh, do any of us notice this? I mean, I don't know. Uh, I mean, well, self check, Jack. Uh, and then oh I guess it's our passive perception. Yeah. And thank God I get advantage. Not, I mean, like it's straight roll, but you know, it's thank God game. it's not disadvantage. Um, yeah, honestly. Uh, that is 17. 
Oh, that beats everyone's 19. passives. Yeah. yeah. You guys notice Jax is gone. Know. Like, by the time you get to the inn, you're like, wait, where the fuck is he? But, like, he's already gone by then. Imagine losing that massive oath. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. Uh, okay, so, what's Jax doing then? Um, I'm looking for. I want to go like to the actual docks themselves. Okay. And I'm looking for not the kind of guy that's going to like stab you in an alley, but like a seedier dock guy. And Jax, you know, he knows docks pretty well, so he mm -hmm. kind of knows the type. Uh, you that's can see that there's an office at like the western side of the docks uh, where you can still see lights kind of like burning through the windows. Okay. I want someone like not like on set the law though, you know? Okay. There's a lot of ships like in the docks uh, and you can see that on one ship in particular, uh, there's a couple of people having some drinks on the top deck, uh, playing some cards, getting a little rowdy. Okay. okay. I'll, uh, I'll call them from the docks. Um, excuse me. What? Would you mind if I joined you? Who the fuck are you? Well, maybe I can tell you over drinks and cards. Got money? Of course. Gambling. What am I going to gamble with? Right. Fair enough. If you want to play, put your money on the line. Get up here then. All right. I'll go up. Um, I'll just say I end up losing like five gold to these guys throughout the thing, just so we don't have to roleplay me gambling. Um, <clears throat> Playing blackjack, you know but, play? Yeah, I, huh? I do. Used to be a sailor back in the day. Did you now? What, what, what shit? I did. I used to, well, I was with uh, the high sea protectors at one point, but... Oh, really? You no know, oh, shit. I use them more just to, I don't know, gain experience. But then... I crewed with one of the most famous captains out there. Who? Vera Silex. Name. I string a bell. Knock a little bit. Uh, wh who's that again? Uh, she's the famous sylph who, well, robbed people blind. Um, I was wondering if her ship had turned back up. How long ago was this? Uh, last I heard of the ship was about, um, seven years ago. Yeah, didn't they find the remains? Like, one of the other people pipes up. Didn't they find the remains of that ship like, a few years ago? Uh, I, I wasn't sure. I've been out of the loop and, um, landlocked for a while. Well, I think it, uh, it, it got, it, it, well, there's a bit of a mystery around that. They say it got, it caught, you know, it hit some rocks, some, some rocks and like a shallow and it, 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 it kind of got fucked, but they were in deep water. So, I, mean, I don't know if you believe. Some people say, you know, they encountered some kind of sea monster. Other people say mutiny may have played a part. So nobody really knows what happened. Um, have you heard of her resurfacing? No. All right. <sighs> and, uh... So, you're saying you sailed with her? Uh, for a time. Huh. What was that like? Uh, well... Honestly, it was exhilarating. Exciting, and I honestly didn't know if I'd live to see the next day. Well, you did. I did. Right. Thankfully. So, but... um, like, what's she to you? Was she just um, captain or friend or family? Or... Um, uh, captain and friend, I would say. Right. Depending well, on the day. Can't say uh, I know anything about her resurfacing anywhere, but. Ship's gone. Entire crew missing. Doesn't look too good. That's what I figured. Um, if you do get any word, I'd be happy to uh, pay for the info. You can leave a note at the friendly giant. What? Who's, who should for, I leave a note for, to? For a Jax. Jax. 
right. Keep an ear, uh, keep all your ear to the ground or water, I suppose. There's ten gold into you for if you hear any information. All right. Good to know. And then I'll just spend a little more time gambling with them, losing the money, <laughs> and uh, then make my way back to the tavern. To the muddy boats, or where are you going? Yeah, yeah, to the muddy boats. Okay. If they're there. Ooh, shivered. So, at the muddy boats, uh, does anyone have like a hard, hard cutoff, or no? I don't no. think. No, not okay, tonight. Cool. I think. So we can we can just we can do like the end of night's role play like the that. Okay. Uh, so How late boats, are we? Like, what's happening? Are we late enough that there's no music anymore, or? Uh, there's some music. Um, okay. Funnily enough, you don't see any. Stuff, you yeah. don't see any like bards playing music, but you definitely hear music. You're not sure. Interesting. Okay. How that works. Just before, like, if like Kes goes up to dance or anything, I'm just gonna tell Kes via sign language that Blackpaw overheard, for lack of a better word, what I said to her about Peter at the meeting. Uh, and I say I don't think he didn't seem like he intended on outing us, but. It was he vague enough. something. <laughs> it, it was vague enough for him to not know what we were talking yeah, about. Yeah, but just just so you're aware. <laughs> Lots all. of shady shit goes down in a city. <laughs> It'll be hard to pinpoint what we were behind. All right. So you guys are having some drinks. Music yep. is blaring. There's a lot of young students just like chug, chug, chug. Like it's a fucking college party in there. <laughs> Behind the bar, there's the two dwarven owners, a man and a woman, that are equally pissed. Uh, <laughs> at this point, no one is paying for drinks anymore because everyone is just so shit faced. It's just it's just turned into a big kegger, really. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we timed it perfectly. You did. Oh yeah. <laughs> so, uh, anything you guys want to do there? Drink. Drink. Absolutely. All right. I think I'd also like to drink. Like to drink? <laughs> Would you like to drink, perhaps? Is that a little too far? I think Any drinkers in that's, the chat? Yeah. I think... Uh, yeah, I want to drink. drink in mind. Okay. <laughs> so you guys drink until you can drink no more. <laughs> uh, drink and dance and, you know, be merry, all that good shit. A few hours go by. Probably get too drunk and then brag loudly to a bunch of <laughs> that we unconvinced Hydra. students that we just killed a fucking Hydra <laughs> and, like... <laughs> Right, so yeah, Always you spend a few hours, kids. Jax at some point joins you and you kind of notice was. him coming back and you're like, where the Snake fuck Snake people go? all around me and a fucking Hydra. <laughs> <laughs> and I knocked two arrows in my bow on time. <laughs> One of his eggs has already missed at this point. And I threw him back and I fucking loosened them both at the same time and I got both of his fucking heads. <laughs> and it was writhing around and it's... <sighs> and that's how we killed the fucking Hydra. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking terrible. Oh. Well, well, I killed the Hydra, but it, you know. You realize what we're that? doing, right? You guys realize what's <laughs> happening that? now? You're just making the fucking the scene we saw from the sneak peek at the Legends of Vox Machina show. We're just yeah. we're just doing that right now. Yeah. <sighs> Alright. Right. So more drinks. Mm. More drinks. <laughs> uh, well, I, I think you owe Kes a dance. You do owe me a dance. Here now? Yes. One, one, Where one, else one, two, one. <laughs> sure, I, I guess. Oh, it's so I uncertain. just lost half a drink on the floor, so I'm going to need it's another not, one. It's not the most classy establishment in the world, but sure. What does class have a part to do with it? I mean, there's no... This is... this The music you're hearing right now is like... Uh, this is some like a lot of drum, a lot of a Project lot of X. drum. Like this oh, is like, yeah. this is like, like, like a medi medieval fucking like drum and bass is going on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it, it's it's not medieval a classy dance, dance situation. <laughs> it's, it's this is not like a grinding at the club situation. Yeah. No, it's Literally. fucking Samwise and Rosie at <laughs> Uncle Bilbo's birthday. No, that's no. that's too that's too wholesome. No, too wholesome. <laughs> Right. It's, well, it's uh, MDM. Like, yeah, it's ma magic dance music. music. Uh, oh, I will yeah. take Kess for a dance. Hell yeah. And, and I will drink. Roll performance check, both of you. Okay. Oh god. How well can Brooke shake his ass? 
How <laughs> really fucking Brooks well. <laughs> <laughs> no, Bro Brooks is like, he he's gone to the wall, he's done a handstand, and he's twerking upside well, he's down. Yeah. While he's doing a fucking kegger. Oh, I have a plus D4 no, like stand while doing Egg stand while twerking, yeah. <laughs> yep. Nice. Uh, nice. performance was... <laughs> uh, 22. 19. I think. Wait. Yeah, I mean, you both, like... 13, 16. It's music that yeah. you're not really very, like, very used to hearing, and for, for you, Cass, is a completely new experience. Yeah, but, uh, you, make it young work. you make it work, Look. and you're both throw you're both like throwing your asses back, and it's uh, you know it's something. It's like Sorry, I called you a pet. <laughs> oh, now <laughs> you have this conversation. Such it was, a conversation. It was definitely a bit oh, out oh, of the oh, blue. <laughs> what did you say? I'll, I'll be honest. It was just it was huh? just what naturally, <laughs> naturally what I thought. Because we travel together. And, and you're a human, and he is obviously not. I, uh, I guess I, I guess he's obviously not. Yes, that is. You're you're not wrong. That he is not a human. Get, as we just get louder and louder. <laughs> music. What did you say? <laughs> uh. So I'm I'm not wrong that he is not a human, but that you are you are not a pet. Well, I I. Definitely not a pet, no, like... Okay. Unless you pay him enough. But you are a human. <laughs> Matter of opinion more than anything, I suppose. Are you, uh, you know, are you a human? No. That's not a matter of opinion. That's just... <laughs> I thought that was the whole discussion with Davian that, like... No, he was asking me if I was made of air. So, so you're not human, but you're not made of air. Okay. I'm not made of air. I'm shit-faced at this point. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, in the Venn diagram of things that are not human and not made of air, <laughs> Kess is right in the middle. Kess is right there. <laughs> oh, that was uh, weird. Well, it, are we all the I mean... non-humans in that same diagram? <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. <laughs> Except for air elementals. Yeah. Oh, human. Just Wait, on one side of yeah, the Sam right there as well, because I'm not human and I'm not air. <laughs> oh, with my Sam, half human. <laughs> I, 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 uh, uh, I, circle. I mean, I never lied, technically. What, the, the, about what, specifically? Nothing, no, it's, it, never mind, it's. No, that you can't just say I didn't lie about something and then not just tell me what you weren't lying about, even though you weren't telling the truth, strictly speaking. Look, it's... It, give me about five seconds to make sense of that in my head and then I'll, <laughs> I'll be with you. <laughs> okay. You have drank a lot. Walks off. <laughs> uh... We... All sort of met up under... Interesting circumstances. Yes, you saw me that, climb a, a, into a window. Yeah, so you know how everyone looked at you and was like, she's climbing into a window, <laughs> clearly she's fucking sketchy. Yes. And assumed that, you know, that whole, like, confrontation. Yes, I can't believe they thought I was the assassin. Like, well, I, I was, killed someone with a crossbow. I, I was trying to avoid that, so, you know, very much lent into the whole, I look fairly normal thing. I understand that. Not... Imagine Sometimes. this conversation happening while they're just both throwing their asses back, dude. <laughs> no, they're both just a handstand twerking, yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I wanted to look fairly normal. <laughs> so what you're saying is you're not human? Uh, yes, no, maybe it's a... Yes, very no, maybe. I'm pretty sure that's a yes or a no Te answer. Not a yes and no Te answer. Technically, I'm a tiefling. You're a tiefling? Oh, but I'm a very... I mean, I mean, tieflings are just like but don't they plain have... touched humans, right? So technically, I'm sort of human, but but th don't they usually have like bright colored skin and you know, the horns and the tails? And I mean, the weird not, eyes. Not wow, all tieflings. Not racism. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I don't have. I, I don't know the ins and outs. Like, obviously, you know, being adopted makes it very interesting. Uh, yeah, that's fair. As, as far as I'm aware, it 
varies depending on where you got your tieflingness from. Hmm, um, that's true. But there are those of us that look fairly human, apart from, you know, horns and some of the shit that a Lazarin does makes me feel a bit pukey at times. But Oh, because it's all, like, religious stuff. I don't like churches mm. and it's why I try to avoid Churches it. are really boring. They're so quiet. I, I try to avoid a lot of his... Uh, Cold. Dark vision -y shit. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> oh, I suppose you don't need it. Uh, it's a much farther distance than I can see on my own at night, but it also leaves me with like a pounding <clears throat> headache and not a fun... I've been drinking too much headache. Not the fun kind of headache. Not not the headache you can fix with like a greasy breakfast and two pints of water. That makes sense. That makes sense. So it, you don't have horns? I don't have horns at the moment. At the moment? Where, where did they go? I mean, the horn... the horns are really, really hard to disguise. Well, yes. Yes. So I took them off. I didn't know you could do that. I don't meet a lot of tieflings. Did you just pull a hellboy? Like, fucking grind them? Like, what? I, as someone that very legitimately grew up working with the heavy tools, it's not that hard. Like, they, you don't feel... You don't feel pain in them. Like, they're just... You know, if you grow your nails really long and then trim them off, it doesn't... You filed them down? Right. Well, yeah. Have you... Do you know how fucking hard it is to try and run, like, some sort of heist or con or otherwise <laughs> swindle someone? When you can only ever reaching, describe like, it. like, up onto his head to try and feel for stubs of Find course. the stubs? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Just, like, I running mean, with fingers through his head. <laughs> there's there. one on either side. We can call him Stumpy now. There, Stumpy. There's, Stumpy. There's, there's, there's one on, you know, like... <laughs> Have you ever, like, imagine trying to run a con, but you can only ever wear a hat. Mm -hmm. Or a really, yeah. really big wig. Yeah, that's inconvenient. You're it's not now. the best. <laughs> it's, it's like, if, if, I, if I use magic to make myself seem smaller, and then someone reaches over my head, they'll just punch me in the face. That's hilarious. <laughs> <clears throat> and then they'll be like, what, why, why is the air above this, this small child really hard, and it's my face? Yeah. Oh, you kiss, the, you the, the, kiss the head of a child, it like just like its neck. Just oh, head butt. Oh fuck. Oh. <laughs> but uh yeah, so I I mean Jax knows, but I it felt like same You don't want me to tell them. I, I I feel like at this point if I tell them it makes me look like a bit of an asshole. That's fair. Okay. You know, well. I, I I've it's been more than a couple of days where I could have been like, yo, by the way, guys, I'm, you know. That's or fair. like, I don't need dark vision of Lazarin or like, hey, okay. I'm, I'm going to be less hurt by fire as this small child is in a burning building. Ah, uh, that makes more sense. And what you said to Siren about having tied her wrist, that, that makes more sense now. I thought you were just yeah, being I nice. It's generally not something I hide, but at the same time, like, people will make us some- Like, it was a very specific niche situation where I'm like, okay, we've just fucking walked up to a crime scene, and they've literally looked at you and gone, you've climbed into a crime scene, you look different, you know, you're in it. So I was like, maybe I should be a bit quiet about this. And obviously I realize now that they're not all horrible racists, but at this point I feel like maybe I've lied a bit too long and- Well, if it makes you feel better, I've been lying too. <laughs> Fucking You're lie. actually some secret like mass murderer? No, no, not quite. No, well then you're fine. Not quite. <laughs> but they, they I only murdered two people. <laughs> well, you've told me your secrets, so I will tell you one of mine and then we're equal. Fair enough? Fair? Are you still yelling over music at this point? <laughs> no, I, I'm assuming at this point, it. like, we're, yeah, we're dancing post. much closer. Just, just making sure, just making just sure. Just that awkward moment when the music, like, stops, you're like, so yeah, anyway. Well, no, because she came closer to touch Brooks's. <laughs> yeah, his, his head. But now she's just playing with his hair. <laughs> yeah. Well, 
I sleep in my bottle. <laughs> I'm, I'm... Run that by me again. I <laughs> at night when everyone's asleep, I disappear into my bottle and I sleep in there. At first, I, I thought it was, it was a, a funky way of saying you were an alcoholic, but no, no. <laughs> I would have bonded with you it's, over it's, that much sooner if I was. It's, it's, I'm not an alcoholic. I believe you now. It's a very small <laughs> bottle. It is a very small bottle. I mean, I go very small. Oh, so it's some sort of magic shit. Yeah. Oh, fuck me. But I can hear as if I was in the space that I'm occupying in the bottle. The bottle stays behind. Obviously. So if we ever get attacked in the middle of the night, I need to shout really loudly and pretend that you were there. Yes. Okay. Probably won't remember that, but we'll see. Also, uh, Daigon doesn't know about it. I think you and Daigon are fairly close. Yes. You might... I used... I feel like you're in the sort of position where I am, where, like, you've... you've I've lied too long, and now if I tell her, then she's going to wonder why I kept it a secret. And that's a whole different bottle that I don't want to open. I have... And climb into a bottle. But, <laughs> but if... <laughs> Dagon's really the best suited to... You know, if something happens while you're in there, then... Maybe you should have a bit of a heart-to-heart -heart with Dagon. That's gonna be so it. awkward. <laughs> yeah, she... She's nice in her own way. Like, she... Well, if I tell her about my bottle, you've got to tell them about your uh, horn stubs. But my horn stubs aren't going to be a problem when we get attacked in the middle of the night. Well, neither is this. <laughs> For you, maybe. For the rest of us, they're like freaking out. Like, where, where, where is Cass? Oh my god, has she been murdered? Has she been kidnapped? No, you're just asleep in some fucking bottle. Well, I would, I would hear the commotion as if I was actually outside of the bottle. And then just appear out anyway? And then I would just appear. So realistically, the moment anything happens, you have to give up the gist on it anyway? Yes. So why not just <laughs> tell everyone at least? Because then I have to ch have an actual conversation rather than just e explaining why you, why by doing. Why do you sleep in a bottle? Why, why are do you I paying for all these fucking fancy rooms for you to sleep in a bottle? I... I don't like sleeping in the dark. You, you have a magical bottle. That you disappear into every night hmm. because you don't like the dark. Must be lit up. In I don't mind. I don't <laughs> mind being in the dark if I'm awake. I just don't like being in the dark and asleep. So I'm sorry. I should laugh. It's just you, you understand how how that sounds, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, Alastrin has a light globe thingy now, so. That's true, but I can't just tell him to like turn it on and then sleep out in the open. That's gonna keep other everyone else awake. And probably get us killed actually. That's and right. probably probably okay. get us killed. Okay, fair. The easiest way to solve this problem is to disappear into a bottle where I can change the light as I want and the temperature. I can you make have it to cozy. admit that it, it's very funny though. <laughs> I suppose well yeah. While you're having a whole conversation, I'm just listening to Davy and drunkenly tell college kids about our exploits. That's what we're doing. <laughs> yeah. Like we're, we're <clears throat> like drunkenly standing Jacks up and like putting an apple <laughs> on his head, and then just like, <laughs> oh no! Right. So <laughs> everyone else is probably gonna think that we've been dancing for far too long. So. I mean, the whole time you've been handstand twerking and just kind of... <laughs> and so, so do we... Do we just get ready to go home or do we just, you know, end it classily and start a punch-up? What? Oh, that sounds like fun. I've never been in a bar, bar, bar fight before. Oh, they I'm always, like, push find... me to the back of the room like I'm oh, gonna break. No. It's very annoying. I'm gonna go find, like, the... Oh, no. Hentious looking motherfucker in the room. Oh, no. <laughs> you look around and there is this human. Uh, very tall. Very broad. 
this old uh, man. Very tall. Kind of just like <laughs> arms crossed, leaning against the wall. Kind of just looking around the room. Is he, is he drunk? Is he stone cold sober? Is he? You don't know. Stone cold Steve Austin. <laughs> you fucking fight the bouncer. <laughs> Oh, I'm tempted. I'm just debating how to initiate it. Like, mm. are you gonna tell us, or are you just going for it? I'm just going for it. Like, I'm. Just, you just watch Bruce walk up to this like fucking bodybuilding oh, no. god. I just like <laughs> slowly like. <laughs> <laughs> Put the arrow back and quiver. See, pick up a. It, stool. It's really funny because I I walked over. <laughs> Because I thought you looked like my friend. And then I realized you just look like a bitch. <laughs> Without he fucking he, he like hand? unfolds his arms and he starts he starts like like ho like hover a bit, they're keeping his balance. Does he protect his fucking sleeves? You what? <laughs> I feel like this is one of those taverns where like you you know there's gonna be a fight, you go there expecting it. I I'm gonna look at him and go, life. oh. I just I like grab were... Jax on the shoulder and like <laughs> point over as I see this going down. Cass is just standing like a few feet I, I, behind him, like. I saw that you were ugly. <sighs> oh no. But I didn't realize you were stupid as well. You look <gasps> like a bitch. Oh. <laughs> 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 sentence, he winds up and natural 20 to hit and just punches oh, you in the fuck fucking, yeah. in the okay. fucking jaw. Okay. I just okay. Jax is like two feet taller than me. I just while I'm holding his shoulder, I just turn him to me, and I just <laughs> like look him in the face. At this point, a group of the students would yell out, "Bonfire!" Oh, and just like fucking decking each other, dude. Yes. I, I can just use my feline agility to get the fuck out, and I'll just wait outside for Kessie. Like she'll Brooks be fucked. Like, I just don't want to be part of this. Fucking six foot broad as fuck dude i'm gonna i'm so gonna good. rage and i'm gonna like i'm just gonna yeah, go for gonna the head she's gonna rage too so. cool. <laughs> fuck yeah uh, i'm as, just gonna as, go for as, the head butt. fucking uh Davy just turns around jacks and just like ah uh, fuck it just starts to like like Davy and you get then get spun around by some random tavern goer and he just fucking pff, uppercuts you and like it's just <clears> it's just a fucking mess it's a grab fucking, a fucking mess. stool and just <laughs> straight into his yeah, mouth. Souls are flying around, oh mugs are God. flying around, tables are being tossed over. I'm it's literally just really outside. Shit. I'm outside, like, leaning against the wall, arms crossed, like, leaning only on one foot, the other's kind of bent, and I'm just waiting to see who comes out first and what state everyone well, comes out who comes out, out, out first, you can, like, you kind of dodge, dodge out of the way, as through the window comes one of the students oh, there and gets tossed through the window onto the street. <laughs> <laughs> Jax is just, like, in the bar, like, throwing bottles and, and, and glasses in the air. Oh, Jax, oh, I feel like, bad. Now I feel bad. I thought Jax was going to be the type, like, I'm too old for shit. Like, like yeah. Like, so yeah, right, right. Right. No, no. yeah, I thought he was going to be, like, old sailor type, and he's just going to take his walking stick I'm and start going in. This shit. <laughs> <laughs> the only person to get hit, Jax, was walking out. Yeah. And eventually... I won't forget about it in the morning. You, you, uh, you, Dagon, as you're waiting outside, you can see a group of guards just <laughs> run, into, run into the fucking pub. And you can hear one of them say, Oh, this shit again. And, <laughs> and they, like, barge into the pub. Everybody gets thrown out, and uh, eventually everyone, like, scatters and goes home. And the guy that what? Brooks fucking started to fight with, like, approaches Brooks and, like, gives, shakes his hand and then fucks off. Oh, and it's like. Hug. I just, I just kind of like we, we one, one more over to Jack. Uh, I, sorry, old man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna take the bottle out of his hand and then hit him over the head with it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> How hard? It. Just like a dunk or like a fucking. No, he's gonna hit you pretty hard. Oh, like, like, a like bottle, bottle shatters, like yeah. Yeah, okay, bottle nice. shatters. Fuck. Fucking glass. Guys, <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I laugh. I like audibly like wheezy laugh because there's no actual sound behind it because like my vocal cords, but Toy just like Story? the exhale, kind of yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hell. <sighs> okay, we're not. I'm not gonna punch you again, but we're not even. All right. <laughs> you did hit me first. 
Let's right. give him the fucking bar stool, to be fair. No, 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 no. no. I over. just left the bar stool and then hit the guy who punched me with the bar stool. And I've got yeah. one arm around Davian, one arm around Jax. Oh, up here. let's head for home. Uh, that was fun. You all make your way to the oh, to the Carif. Uh, yeah. Is there anything you can see that up to? Bloody. Uh, I mean, I would have I would have gone for a bath. Mm -hmm. I don't know, Siren is free to join me if she wants, but <laughs> I would have just gone by myself. I would have been like, let's go bath, yeah. Um, and then I, I I would have treated her to a nice meal as an apology and all whatever she wanted from the drinks menu, and just been like, have us my treat. Welcome to the finer dining of Aldalon. What did you day. recommend? RP the day. Oh, I mean, it's a fine red wine. That's a sort of a favorite of mine, and I'll pick out like the the Take sort that, of middle priced then. Merlot. And I mean, meal wise, it's sort of a good steak. Doesn't go, <clears throat> it can't go wrong. But obviously, if there's anything new you want to try, usually the weirdest horse I know, like an escargot, maybe. What's that? Oh. It's like. Stales. Oh, I've, I've, I've eaten slugs. I imagine similar. Oh, fair enough. Well, I have no idea. I've not eaten slugs, so. Don't recommend it. I'll remember that. Um, How about you just order for me and I'll just surprise me? Don't oh, just. Uh, what is like a fucking weird sounding thing on the menu? What's like, it's like a special that's like. Um, <clears throat> fuck me, dude. Sorry to do this to you. So, I mean, not weird like per se, pet. but very like exotic. Fish. Is yeah. uh, there's 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 swordfish on the menu. That's something you don't see. Fuck right done. Bracken oh, calamari. So done. Uh, done. Swordfish. swordfish. I will. I ordered like <laughs> swordfish for both. Okay. And comes like served on like a bed of different like veggies and some like like. Mm. I have no idea what the fuck they're called in English, but they're like these, like, they're like it's mashed potatoes, but like, mm. like, piped in like a certain shape and then fried to yeah. become crispy yeah. on the outside and yeah. like Ooh, that. And... A croquette? Yeah. No, no, it's no, no, like no. It's, not, it's yeah. not quite a croquette. It's, it's... Yeah. I know what you mean, but I can't think of it. I know what you mean, yeah. 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 It's like, probably got a really fancy <laughs> French sounding name. I mean, yeah. uh, we do have like Dutch's potatoes here, which is, um, I have no idea. But like, like that is like, it's basically. Like Salt, eh? mashed potatoes, but like with a crispy outside because it's been like fried after yeah. it's been mashed, pretty much. That's awesome. Uh, in yeah, like it's a, basically Dutch little, potatoes in, in a little uh, in a little, little little fancy shape. Um, <clears throat> it's a banger of a meal. Hell yeah! Is the fancy shape a smile? No, <laughs> it's not a potato <laughs> smile. All it, the it's, smiles it's, do slap, dude. They do. Uh, all the uh, esteemed gentlemen uh, saw the fish with the uh, potato smiles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're really out market until they get to potato. And it's just like, ah. Uh... I don't know, man. Back in the day, if you had someone hand shaping these into smiles, like, oh, yeah, you them and then frying them, that's pretty fancy. True. Like, that's got to be their expensive kids menu. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Right. So you have your dinner, have some drinks. Don't get me started on the turkey dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the now dinosaur now real dinosaur meat. Um, <laughs> huh? <laughs> uh, Brooks is singing uh, sea shanties very nice. badly the entire uh, way home. Still me. Me. Pretty early. Like I'm not. I'm not planning on doing anything. Uh, pretty soon. I'm just gonna go to bed and. Come. If it's a, is it like is the is the room too bedded? Uh, no. Is it a twin or a double bed? Yeah. It's and there was only one bed. Uh, I will offer Sir in the bed and I'll sleep before. It's big enough for the both of us. Oh. I will. I'll sleep in the bed then if that has been offered. Right. You top and tail or sleep. do you cuddle? Yeah, actually. Do, do, you, do you top and tail <laughs> no. or do you cuddle? <laughs> We do not tell and tell, but up to soon if we cut I'm not gonna you build like a pillow. Wall imagine between it's not you. going to uh... A good man does not kiss and tell. True. No, uh, <laughs> Lazarin is just he's vibing. He doesn't want do to. Do you take your socks off? Oh, freak seat to their socks on. Yeah, that's that's a fucking that's a fucking crime. <laughs> uh, you took your socks yeah. off in bed with her? What a degenerate. Like you basically fucked. Right. Anyway, <laughs> so you walk to the all also uh, <laughs> get to the get to the hotel. 
Uh, what's the room uh, situation gonna be like? How many keys do we did were we were we left? You, got, uh, you guys have um, thirty-two um, and thirty-three. No, thirty-one. There's, there's 33. the four of you, and there's there's two, rooms, two doubles. Okay. Because I've got thirty-four, so yeah. I suppose it's me and Diamond three then. Yeah, and and, and Davian's got thirty-three. Okay. What? So right. Brooks is in thirty-four. Discord. I'm in thirty-four oh, no. alone. My Discord broke. Okay. Uh, oh. Is Kes, is Kes taking up Davian's offer, or is she going with Dagon? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Either okay, way, Davian's again? passing the fuck out. So. <laughs> so. Uh, I'm it's back. Back. Discord's back. Okay. I'm so Jax. So me Jack, and Jack. Guess, me and Jax are the beat of the shit come, out of each other. Come sleep on the floor in my single room. What? Or... No, I thought I was just gonna share with Dagon. No, you're sharing with Davian, because Cass is sharing, sharing with Davian. Davian. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine. Alright. As all, I nurse the fucking... You all <laughs> pass the fuck out. Uh, Bruce. Uh, Lazarus asked that. the staff to put sick buckets next to all of our um, beds. Probably, actually, yeah, he would have. And we'll end it there. You'll wake up the next Yay. morning. <laughs> we hope. We'll end it there for the, for, for the week. And the next week, we'll be back. We'll pick this up. Uh, some free time in Eldalon, maybe do some, you know, do some random things here or there. Go exploring a little bit more, because there's a lot of the city left unexplored. Oh and, yeah. Um, around. The week after that is our, uh, the week after oh, that is our Halloween shot. one shot. Oh, so next week will be a Soko down. This Thursday we'll have, uh, Laura and Ethan on Discourse. Hello. And tomorrow Hello. me, Duke, and Ethan will be playing Divinity Original Sin 2 on the channel. Sure will. Hello. I'm gonna um, make another fucking toothpaste, man. That's the that's the that's the weekly planning for this channel here. Um, oh, yeah. Excuse me. Thanks for watching, yeah, everybody. Get that Lord uh, download up early. Okie okay, Rebel, thanks for the follow and the tier one sub. Back to yeah, back. Yeah, Daniel. Wow. Appreciate that. Wow. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll be back here with Dungeon Select Session Eleven next Sunday. Uh, like we said, some other stuff happening uh, throughout the week. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Appreciate ya. And we'll uh, we'll see you next time. Take care. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.